excited like a little kid. True. This game is actually in uh, 69 resolution, which is kind of crazy. That's wild. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I want to watch this. I want to watch this, but I want to drink. Oh, I'm excited for this. All right, let's watch the intro. We gotta see it. It's probably referencing what I. It's literally. It seems like it's gonna be the direct continuation of what I just did, which was kill mother and get the secret of life. There it is. Kaboom. Lambo Lambo 2. Alright. Alright. It's time, boys. It's time. I am I'm 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 so fucking excited for this. I am so fucking excited for this game. Lumisa Kosugi. Oh, that's like Lemesa's kid. <laughs> Elder Selpet. <laughs> what the fuck? He's still chilling, he's still chilling. Oh, my items. Was oh, she just gonna leave that behind? Alright. Yeah, Lemesa Kosugi, Sean Kosugi. Oh, this is going so fast, holy shit. So, this is like the descendant. Mulbrook? Oh. <laughs> She's got clothes now. Normal clothes. We're American. American Japanese or something. There were two flags on me. Oh my god. I'll say the production quality has gone up. The seventh the zeroth body, the nice spirit. Well that's the giants, isn't it? Black Voxel, thank you for the tier 1. For now, for the 5 tier 1s. Thank you, man. I know you don't want hints, but now people are completing this game. A few people who completed this game came, so there will be less backsetting. But now, less pe few people completed this game. Wait, really? I thought most people played this one first. This is start, fuck it. Right into the game. Oh, you can change direction with there. You can. You have much more. But, oh, but this is nice. You can do much more. Mad money. It literally starts out. Oh, more physics. Faster free screen transitions. You can crouch. The fuck is this? There's a thing here. Probably just a rock. Village of the Port. <laughs> There's Selphood. Hot spa. Oh, wait. <laughs> it's- I can't show you with my cursor, but it says Entrance XD. It says Entrance XD on the fucking sign. Oh, he's got bitches. Hey, you made it. I'm Selput, elder of the tourist village La Mulana Ruins. Oh, shit. <laughs> this guy's got mad bitches. Look at him down there. Sunglasses. This is wild. I gotta make a new uh, notepad. One noting begins, boys. Lamelana, new page. La. 
Non that too. One page called Tablet Notes, one called NPCs. We're in Labellana still. We finally managed to turn the Labellana ruins into a tourist spot and now we're gift getting reports of unknown monster sightings. So I sent a letter to your dad, your call archaeologist. Asking him to come investigate. So how come he sent his daughter? You can't get a hold of your dad? So you break into archaeology and immediately surprise your dad, huh? What a weird family. Anyway. We'll try secret picking even if accidental as always. If I, I, of course I will. I will. This is a game where you have to try everything, right? You gotta try everything. Anyway, the request was for finding out what, just what is going on in the Lamalana ruins, and then taking care of whatever the problem was. If you can handle it yourself, that's fine with me. You must have completed your, your dad's ninja training by now, right? Apparently the monsters have been coming from the depths of the ruins. With all this danger, nobody's gonna want to come here anymore and we're gonna lose all our business. Figure out the cause and make sure those monsters never come out again. But with my, my being such a gentleman and all, I'm gonna do you a favor and help a cute little girl out. Lend me that their tablet real quick. This is my very own homegrown messaging software. I'll send you helpful hints and stuff to your to help you out with your investigation. When you hear the funky little beep notification, just hit the pause button and check out the tablet. You can thank me later. Cell put required. Nope. Oh really? <laughs> It's me, good morning, Viet Mulana. You'll get messages from me like this one. I can see where you are using your tablet camera. I will teach you the ABCs of adventuring. I'm such a gentleman. Try wandering around above ground a bit before entering the ruins. It'll be a good practice. Don't leave me hanging. Read your messages. Alright. That's better. Another message already. That pimped out looking st stone there, tablet there. That's the a holy grail tablet and it can hold memories. What that means is you can save by pressing the up button in front of the tablet. Oh, it's up instead of down now. You better be make sure to read what's written there too. Come on, promise an old man. There we go. We got the hot spring here. Can we talk to these people? No. That there is one of my village famous hot springs. I'll buck you right up. Restores your health too. Go to town with it, but take your clothes off first. Huh? Okay. Fucking <laughs> cell Chat's non screen. Wait, really? Where's the. Ch Oh, I must have disabled it by accident. There we go. Sorry. Oh, it's this button now. That big ass tent on the hill is where Al Sadana lives. Al Sadana was one of the four philosophers. They headed up. They headed up the ceiling of Lavalana, and there, and he was their top guy. Now he's all lives in a peace and quiet. Don't forget to say hi. Okay, I should probably play this in window mode, right? It's gonna be it. whatever. I don't have my tablet reader yet. I just lie and wait for death to come. God damn. I'm gonna write this down.
I am one of the four philosophers who wants Can you, can you like... No, you, you can't control, you can't like c copy the text. I wish they would add like a, is there a mod for this game so you can like copy text on the screen, is that possible? So I can just paste it, that would be sick. Visit. Since you've come all this way to see me, I'd be happy to tell you whatever you'd like to hear about the old days. Alright. Windows Shift S. What does that do? Pretty sure one would search the image for text. A screenshot of text should be searchable. I don't think that's gonna work out. Anyways, this is where the double jump was, wasn't it? You can crouch and walk, cool. Interesting. You can look up too. Oh, this, this is... Crouching and looking up is gonna be related to some puzzles, I'm sure. Does she go to bed ever? Okay, she does also sleep at some points. Cool. That's important. Yeah, I don't have any scanners yet. Thank you. I can scan. All of the shopping, huh? You can use the items by equipping them and pressing the item button. Uh, and there's more to, more out there than the run-of-the-mill hand scanners. The ruins hold key treasures, weird items, but you gotta put someplace, um, all kinds of stuff. Bring them to me, and I'll tell you what they are if I can. That is cool. So this in this game it actually says it. Two hundred. Okay. Pistol expensive. Let's go tour bus timetable. One bus in the morning, if, if you feel like it. Eight hours to the closest city or an airport. One is tower bonus tour. Why well, yes, you did hear it right. There's a ruins dotting the area around Lauten Lana. Sign up and you can explore the area beyond the jungle on the village outskirts. Note, the Oana's tower bonus tour humbly requests you bring your own shovel. You're going to need it. Oh, hello. Nabur, hey there, you're investigating your ruins? If so, you're definitely gonna add, need a hand scanner. Brought one yet? Yeah, well done. It, but once you in the map, it's a tourist map for Lamananas. I like one. Here you go. You can use the map itsel by itself though, don't forget to buy a map app at the shop over by the hot springs. Okay. I like that they actually tell you to do these things in this game instead of it being like, oh, just, just, just do it lol. Yeah, DLC is gonna be epic. I can't wait for that. This is known as the Holy Great Hablet that has been in this village for generations. Examine it. Uh, whatever that means. 
and it will bring back your memories of this place. Basically, you can save if you press the up button. So I'll put, yep. Did I read my first thing? Map reader. Alright, so now I have a map of the... Okay. Have you bought the map app from Never yet? The app is used to manage your maps, but you gotta collect the maps yourself. The maps are ru of the ruins are hidden in each site. Load apps from the app in your tablet. I've already loaded the software for you to read my messages. Make sure you keep uploaded at all times. My uploaded, yeah. So now I can... There we go, map epic. Let's read the sign up here, actually. Village altar. The altar is used by the villagers. Please maintain the respectful silence. Okay. Welcome to the Lamalanda Ruins, humanity's last great discovery, the world's largest ancient ruins. Get your souvenirs from the brew shop. <laughs> okay. You see, he, he turned... He, the, the place collapsed and they turned it into a fucking tourist spot. It's great. He's, he's on the fucking grind, man. She's got a weird looking baby. I'm sure she did. Money? Construction ongoing. We are busy repairing the structural collapse of the ruins. Danger. Do not enter. Chief Construction Samaranta. I can't get further up here now, can I? No. I need a double drop or some shit. So you have like your own like balancing animation like this. Cool. Let's go into the ruins then. Watch your step. Face mural. There are several face murals by the ruins entrance. They contain mechanisms to make the eyes glow, but it isn't effect in effect at your current time. The reason for the mural's construction is unclear. Please head downwards. Warning, please do not jump off the edge unless you are a qualified ninja or ar archaeologist. I believe I am. Split gate. Similar to the Kandi Benatar at Bali Island, but decorated differently. It's thought to have been built in tribute to the creator of the Lamalanda ruins, but these claims are unverified. There are also tales that people get merged on the here at once, here once, but these claims too are unverified. Amazing. Oh, okay. There's a little light here, though. Oh, it's a ladder. Epic. The mural of departure. A mural thought to be depicting the history of Lamalana ruins, though these claims have not been verified. The ruins through the gate on the right are known as the Gate of Guidance. We're gonna go there again? Gate of Guidance. That there is the ruins of Lamalana. Back in the day, your dad explored and well destroyed the place. <laughs> Reconstruction is ongoing, but keep going down and you'll get the Mausoleum of Giants, where the monster's been spotted. Don't go anywhere weird, and you should be fine. God damn it, I, sh I should set to investigate the place, not jack it all up. I'm trying to tourist the place up, you know. Alright. This area around the entrance of Lamalana is known as a gate for guidance. The ruins are split into sections, such as this one, and it's been determined that these sections were created and inhabited by different races. I'm gonna, I'm gonna notice the thumb the moment I think they like, they have like any... Because this is just like, well, I've already known this from my previous notes. notes. Doesn't seem important. I like the music here though, it's nice. Is that fucking self hood? <laughs> okay, dude. The depths of these ruins are pitch black. They were once lit by undying flames, but the these flames winked out when the ruins collapsed. Warning, there are bats in the ruins, so we'd appreciate if you it killed them for us. Alright. Hey, you got him. My first kill. I wonder if I can go in there.
Treasure chests. There are many treasure chests hidden throughout the ruins. You will need to undo mechanisms unlocking them. For example, this chest can be unlocked by placing a weight on the pedestal below. Amazing. It's gonna be the shell horn. Let me get those things, man. They're gonna despawn now. Shit. Yep. Got him. Shell horn. Amazing. You got the shell horn? I mean, it's one of the artifacts on display in the ruins, so whatever. I'm such a gentleman, I'll give it to you anyway. The shell horn lets you know once you've solved one of the ruins' mysteries with a sound that sounds kind of like a mystery solved. Get stuck in a trap and it makes a sound like, that's a trap. Okay. Oh, the children are displayed here, that's crazy. Uh, black and red dog husky, thank you for the prime, yep. The first children, reconstructed based on the surviving records and recovered fossils. A race with snake-like lower bodies thought to have been resembled in the mother more closely than other. Many aspects of the race are a mystery as there are few records of them. Second children, the reconstruction of the race known as Giants. This race, which is said to have constructed nearly the entirety of Blamalana, is relatively well documented, allowing for detailed reconstructions down to the accessories they wore. There are many statues of that pray in praise of the Giants, but it is unclear exactly how giant they were. The third children, reconstructed based on the surviving records of recovered fossils, this race had bird-like wings protruding from their backs. Analy analysis of the remains suggests a drastically different physical makeup from the modern man, including slender bodies, turned for flight, and long limbs. They are distinguished by the long, backwards, arcing chest that stems from their hands. Crest that stems from their hands, right. Fish! The fourth children, reconstructed based on surviving records and recovered fossils. Records note that they have fish bodies. But whether that means they're fish-bodied or human fish, human with fish-like features is unclear. The recorded history is remarkably sparse, suggesting they were not significantly intelligent. The fifth children, registered the base and surviving record. Okay. They had a body structure that closely resembled the modern man, with evidence suggesting that they were shorter stature. Stature. Records detail that they established some means of creating, creating life itself, pointing towards extreme intelligence, they created the sixth children. The sixth children, spawned by the fifth children's life-creating device, the tree of life. They were born by imbuing clay bodies with life. Their vast numbers splintered into warring factions. All analysis suggests they were almost physically indistinguishable from modern man. Uh, six distinct races are thought to have lived in Lamalana. These races are called the first of six children. The expression children comes from the fact that their mother, Lamalana, created them. Incidentally, we, we the villagers are the seventh children, and you, our patrons, are the eighth. Crazy. Now my chat's clear to the fourth. This is you. That's that's you, chat. That is you, man. But we already knew all of this, so that's fine. I like the music here, it's really nice. What? Construction are going. We are busy repairing the structural collapse of the ruins. Danger, do not enter. Chief of construction, Samaranta. Aids. Hmm, can you go in there? I don't have enough jumps to get there, anyways. The face looks scared now. It looked more menacing before. Face mural bears a striking resemblance to the colossal Olmec head at the Laventa ruins in Mexico. We oh, can jump up like this now, that's crazy. Couldn't do that before. Vases often have coins or weaponry inside. Some vases, such as the one above, are out of immediate reach. Perhaps there is were ancient Perhaps there were ancient ancient foreigners who could jump their way up. Well the previous Kosig could not jump up here. Unless he had double jump. Even then, no, actually, in the first game, you actually couldn't make it up here. Unless you, you damage boosted off of an enemy on the top floor. Can I go into the mouth and go into the hell temple? No. Yeah, face mural. Ancient Mayan airship? There's a striking resemblance to Olmec era artifacts found in Mexico. Looks like at once, like a decorated flute and a man riding an airship. A mechanical god. All the mental ruins in Mexico appears to be a human riding a dragon shaped machine. Yeah. 
Destroy Lamelona for a second time. I bet nobody will mind. Yeah, <laughs> why not? These the ruins are labyrinthian. The room on the left, for example, cannot be reached conventionally by human means, unless the human is capable of jumping incredible distances. Warning: Do not attempt to jump unless you are absolutely certain you can. Only a certified ninja or archaeologist can make a jump. What? <laughs> okay. Door to oh, don't need this area even. The elevator is out of order. Yikes. One game later, we're still cucked from going to Eden. Holy Grail! The chest above contains the artifact known as the Holy Grail. It's said that reading a Holy Grail tablet will record its location in the Holy Grail, allowing you to instantaneously recall your very being back to the said location. It surprises artifacts to so ask patrons not to handle it. Yikes. What's this? Heener. Sorry, but the shop's not open yet. I'm thinking of opening up once things calm down a bit. If you're inspecting your ruins, I'll give you a helpful tip. You see the treasure chest inside the shop? It can be opened by hitting it from below. There's helpful stuff inside. Thank you. We're all of this. Oh, you can you can ca you can catch ladders while being in the air. Thank you, Nigoro. Holy grid required. There we go. We got it. Anyways, I can't go over here, can I? Looks like there's a thing up there, though. On the on the right. There's like a yellow pixel on the top right there. Curious. Path within the construction following the collapse of the ruins, which I had nothing to do with, by the way. Feel free to crawl over the rubble or and climb on the, on the girders. I had nothing to do with, by the way. Alright. Climb of the girders. Oh, I can actually crawl down there. Nice. I'm very bad at spotting ladders, if you can't tell. You can drop off ladders by pressing jump. Oh, really? Oh, that's very nice. That's very nice. Because they all have the same names, I guess. This is gonna be the... Oh, are we gonna have like a remix of Grand History? Are we? <laughs> oh my god, my favorite song. Okay, that's a disappointment. Anyways. Uh, this, section, this section of the ruins contained monuments to the giant race, the second children. The, ex the extensive damage to the Muslim giants will still in repair. Please watch your step. Alright. We're getting shmoned though. So this game actually has a tutorial. We're going through the tutorial now, I guess. Because this is not obviously the, the ruins we're gonna explore. Josh, thank you for the five dollars. You are streamer of the week on peppymerch.com. Just found you. Pretty dope. <laughs> what? Am I? What the fuck? How did that happen? Well, I appreciate it, I guess. Ooh, Nebra Sky Disc. An astronomic mural with carvings of the sun, moon, and stars. It can be inferred that the foreigners who lived in Labalana's ruins had a sophisticated grasp on astronomy. The mural containers contains records of successful communication between the foreigners and extraterrestrials. Okay, crazy. It's wild. I want 
Oh. Oh my god, they found the hidden treasure, boys. It's wild. This is the elevator, okay. Doesn't seem to be anything here, I guess. Or you can like... Oh, there was a ladder. I, I, again, I'm very bad at seeing ladders. Especially these type of ladders. This was like the ladder I can never see in the... Fucking... Uh, God, Tower of the Goddess. Ever. Cursed tablet. The tablet had is cursed. It said that those who dare read it twice will meet with, with, with misfortune. It was relocated here for safety as all signs suggest the curse is still active. Warning, do not read it under any circumstances. Play hard, but this time, maggot, you have the experience. You're forbidden from laying eyes on this tablet again. Those who do not heed this warning will suffer pain of death. <laughs> Did we activate hard mode? I think since I have the experience of the first game, is hard is is hard mode again like really bad or would it be really bad? There's another movement thing that does not get taught as far as I remember. Those upward stairs can be climbed by pressing the up. Up. Up left. Up right. Okay. Wouldn't recommend. We can do a hard mode playthrough at some at some later time, I guess. But uh, would there be a point in that? Nah, I'll not. I'll not do it because it's it's as far as I. It's actually much harder. Yeah, there's gonna be more enemies, and the bosses do more damage and have more health. Like it's. Uh... What? You mean, what do you mean the stairs? Climb the stairs. You can just climb them by walking into them. Kind of by walking. <laughs> what are you talking about? You mean the stairs here? No stairs. Are you trolling me? There's no stairs here. This stairs? No. They will exist later? Okay, then you're getting banned. Stop timing me out, or st stop timing me out. Stop fucking backsitting. It says no hints. Read. Let the nine giant siblings, Sebu is the eldest brother, set so out attempted to maintain peace between his siblings throughout their conflict. This may be why he is immortalized as a figure holding up the earth. Mm hmm. You want a pair of eyes? I've got a spare one. Uh, you want the back? Yeah, here we go. There we go. I'm gonna be more strict at this game. Yikes. I like this movement. It's epic. You can like do a... Uh, yeah. More shit. Like jump on his leg. You can't stand on his leg anymore? Okay, cringe. Cringe. What is this? Warning, repairs not being completed beyond this point. In the, in the interest of safety, please record your journey before moving on. Oh. There's a different type of safe spot here. I see. Miguelo and Futo statue. Miguelo, Futo... Wait, this is Miguelo? I got it wrong in the early... Okay, anyways. 
Miguel of Utobado and Leda were known as the Star Giants. Their goal was to leave the ruins and venture to space. Murals have been unearthed that suggest that they communicated with extraterrestrials. Okay. I, I should probably do that later. Baldur statue, said to have been the first of, to fall in the battle against the moon giants. Oh, the map scrolls! You can actually go- oh my god, that's crazy. <laughs> that's wild. Got a skeleton. It's not so bad being a skeleton. I've made lots of friends. Look at all the roaches. I made it deeper into the ruins than Ed Roach. Lido statue, said to have been killed when stabbed through the chest by the moon giant Sakit. Theories suggest that she wanted to escape to the surface not only out of principle, but because she dreamed of seeing the sun. Note, Lido statue is undergoing repair. The head is less complete than at, than at time of discovery, and research into restoring it is underway. Okay. Can I jump under here? No. Oh, spooky. Oh my god. Do not hit me. Oh, that, that, I thought that was Miguela. I thought this was Miguela. Who the fuck is this? It's Rebu. The statues in this room are of a group of giants known as the Moon Giants. This one, Ruby, was executed for colluding in the Star Giants rocket development plan. <laughs> he actually made a rocket. How is it compared to one so far? I like the movement a lot, and the music is nice. Well, when it's here anyways, it's nice. G statue, Moon Giants, those who wanted to remain in the living living in these lands of Lavalana, revolted against the Star Giants. It's said that the Moon Giants pray prayed for the confliction to come to an end. That's a crystal skull, hello. Okay. Sakit! Sakit is attributed with sparking the conflict between the giants when he attacked Lido. The ta tale of how he abandoned a key imbued with his power into Lido's body before falling into slumber continues to captivate the imaginations generations later, but Sakit's motives remain a mystery. Sakit's statue is under repair. That was just a backflip of a moron. Hello. Abuto, the last giant to have lived, credited with leaving a record of the giant's history to the future. P.S. Abuto is under repair. Who this? Samaranta. What a great help, I think. You defeated that squirrel monster? What impressive power. My apologies, fighting is not exactly my forte, so I stayed hidden. My name is Samaranta. I am one of the seventh children, and I was once the f one of the fourth philosophers. However, as one of the younger members, I have been assisting in the post-collapse inspection and the restoration of the ruins. I have planned on visiting the Fairy Queen, who still resides in a secret deep within this place. But at this rate, repairs don't look to, to finish remotely soon. The elevator above has been repaired. It connects to the Gate of Guidance, so pass through the gate and head toward the Gate of Evolution. There you shall meet with another of the four philosophers, Phobos. It's believed that the phenomena occurring within the ruins has something to do with the Aglana ruins, aka the other side of Alamalana. That's where we're going. That huge squirrel seems to have warped here to the Mausoleum of Giants somewhere else. From somewhere else. If it came from Aglana, then the cause of these problems may also lie there as well. Would you like to hear that again? Mm. I can note that the Ferris Queen is still here, I guess.
Lily, thank you for the one dollar. I'll read for a while inspecting the repairs. Alright. Endless uh, tunnel. Hmm. Gate of Guidance. Okay, let's go to the Illusion Gate. Crazy. I guess you should definitely play the first one first in this case. Otherwise you would have this spoiled. Well, it's actually, actually it's not much to be spoiled because they're kind of covered in shit anyways. <laughs> when the wall is breakable. Face mural. Bears a striking resemblance to this all mech in the elemental rooms in Mexico. Yeah. Is that a fucking eye of, eye of uh, punishment? Divine Retribution? I guess it's not active because the ruins are dead. <laughs> fucking Phobos on the computer. Who are you? Oh, it's the daughter of the man who solved the mystery of the Lamalana ruins, I see. I am Phobos, one of the four philosophers. Phobos is a gamer now. Since being freed from the Lamalana ruins and completing my duties as a philosopher, I've been living here. I've been, I'm trying to recreate the ruins that were destroyed and the relics that were lost when our father solved... When your father solved the said mystery. Anything I'm able to properly recreate, I send to one of the shops in these ruins. So do me a favor and buy whatever you can. I received most of the pertinent details from Samaranta. It seems that the monsters have begun appearing in Lamalana once again. With the defeat of the entity known as the Mother, the Lamalana ruins were supposed to have become simply that, just ruins. Um, the monster spotted by Samaranta apparently had the ability to move freely to space. That leads us to believe that it came from the lands of the exile of Eglana. Though we know nothing about it other than that it exists. I assure you, you have some questions for me, yes? What is the Mother? The Lamalana ruins were constructed inside the huge living entity known as the Mother. It was said to have fallen to this planet from the skies long ago and have gained the gave birth to its progeny, progeny for the purpose of creating a workforce to send it back into space. Those progeny are us, mankind. We four philosophers were of the seventh group to be born, known as the Seventh Children. Um, uh, I know all of this. You modern humans, by the way, are part of the group known as the Eighth Children. Your race was born from a life-giving machine called the Tree of Life. Oh, we were too? Into which we, the seven children, imbued our own memories and mind in order to create you. Eglana is known as the child of Lamalana. The child reference brings something to mind. Step aside for a second. This is called the child statue. I live here precisely because looking at this statue imp inspires my research. In the Lamalana ruins, there isn't much else with a similar name, so look into it. She just shrugs. My inspiration. Mm, the gate won't open. Let me try it. Ah, it opened. It would appear as though it would only open for the, those possessing the mother's power. For a seventh child like myself, it's easily opened. But for an eighth child without the mother's memory such as yourself, I guess it can't be opened. I don't know what exactly brought you here, but I feel it like it was fate. If the Eglana ruins that we philosophers were investigating really do, do lie beyond this gate, then the entire world... Could be in grave peril. Ask and you shall be given. Think and you shall find. Words of wisdom for those wishing to face the ruins. Come see these philosophers if you have any trouble. Uh, lend me your tablet before you go in. This is a type of software that records data left in the ruins. I developed it myself. If you can find some sort of merc chips loaded with data, I suggest gathering them. Oh, my inspiration. All right. Sure, let's just go in then. Eglon, oh, we're already here. Cool. All right. 
End word percents. Level one or two. So that was a tutorial, I guess. You didn't finish the first one? I did, yeah. I, I just didn't do Hell Temple because it was. Uh, anyways. Roots of Yggdrasil. Oh, we're gonna do. Are they gonna do Norse mythology now? Epic. This is Phobos. I just hacked your tablet so that I can communicate. When investigating the ruins of Labolana, I picked up some information about the Eglana ruins as well. They're built similarly, so I'll find. So I'll fill you in on what I can. Oh, snap, did you just read the cursed tablet? It says right there that you're not supposed to read it. Don't, don't it? I don't know what is exactly actually gonna happen, but well, whatever it is, it's gonna suck. And apparently there is no way to undo that curse. Don't come crying to me if you're up your butt cheeks and ghosts. Stop reading those things. You summon the treasure of the Holy Rail? Hmm. That's a precious treasure dis display item, you know? But it's necessary for the investigation, so what are you gonna do, huh? I'm pretty laid back, aren't I? If you have the Holy Grail, you can warp places. It's awesome. You know the Holy Grail tablet near my castle? My castle. He actually has a castle. That's, that's crazy. Um, the thing used for saving. You can warp the places. Yeah. Please. So walking through them, and again, that's that's fine. Jumping on them is not, though. Welcome, Denison of the Mother's World. This is the world of fools at constant war. A land of battles destined for ruin. Are you harboring a ruin, or do you simply flow on in the tide? You pitiful one, will never know freedom from Sturgill. Okay. Tablet notes. Root of Egdrasil. Oh no. You pitiful one who will never know. Yeah, we're gonna do some typing, I think. Can I scan this? Can I scan that face, yes. There do be a door here, though. Really? Who are you? This is Eglana, the land of exile where only the wo Where one only ca wait for death. And this place itself is the deepest level of Eglana, the roots of Yggdrasil. Leave this place now if you value your life. New NPC. I was like, notes. Time for 10 trillion pages of lore just for the simplest puzzle in the game. Yep. Fuck it. I'm writing everything down. I'm not gonna make the same mistake as, as, as I did last time, where I missed like one conversation that was important, and uh, had to like watch a vod for two hours to find it. So I'm not doing. I'm not doing that. Anything else? Alright, really, thank you. On with the game, shall we? Money? Guide! Bat! What? <laughs> bat. What do you find in every dark cave? Bats. The Lamolani ruins, now in a tourist attraction, is no exception. 
Bats aren't particularly dangerous, but they can be a nuisance when they get in your hair. They can be difficult to spot hanging from the ceiling too. Interesting. This is gonna be a part of a big puzzle. It's <laughs> why is this an N? Courier, thank you for the three gifts, man. Do we have something? Tribe Lokapala. Race six. Oh, you immediately know the race too. Sixth child. Mili was once a sage. Those who remain at the roots of Eagle were exiled further away than most in Eglana. In the solitude, the villa began to crumble in both body and mind. Rip. Map! Oh, it's just like the first game, man. Skvader. Wait, this is actually Norse? A rabbit uh, drop coins. It says it drops to a tree soul. A rabbit with the wings of a bird. While it can, can't truly really fly, they are able to jump and execute a sort of a gliding motion. Contempt to prance around a harmlessly. They are not aggressive toward humans. Fachan. Oh shit. Drop shuriken. A one-eyed single-legged creature. Fachan appear to have no arms. But there's a strange arm concealed within their mouths. Which they use to ensnare prey. They are said to be the ranged... Degraded form of goblin-like creature. Yikes. From the top down is the basics of ruins exploration. If you fall down to the bottom first and can't get back up, you're screwed. Okay. There's something below here. Guaranteed. There's guaranteed something down here. I can tell by the pixels, boys. I'm gonna ponder the orb. I got 64 health though, that's nice. Epic. Looks like the rooms of the maps. Looks like the rooms of the ruins have names. Some someone give me a map and I'll, s I'll seriously buy one. Yeah, okay. The map is right here now. I like hearing that sound. Map. Path. Okay, we gotta write down all the map names now. Let's make a new page. Map. The Pogress sound. Path to the roots. Noted. Guide skeleton. Fucking Pikachu here. Carbuncle. <laughs> the Holy Grail revives memories of lands once visited. Hold it in hand and the, rouse those memories. Your very being shall be summoned the Rito. Okay. That's a that's a that's a typo, isn't it? There too. That's a typo, I think. The re two, not a typo. Okay, totally a typo. Time to go to work, GN chat. All right, mix master. How are you, good old man? I'm gonna be enjoying the fuck out of this game in the meantime. <laughs> the lower parts of these ruins are scary. I think I'll try exploring the upper parts first. Okay, time for a rest for all eternity. That is. <laughs> okay. Oh, it was not a. You fucker. I like this, this tutorial skeletons. This is the roots of Yggdrasil, the roots that connect the world to the land of beginnings. Beginnings. Fortunately, I can type somewhat fast, so we got that. What does this guy say? Skeleton. <laughs> 4 HP. Lifeless bones to which soul, soul has been returned. They can be attacked and broken, but they will only rise again to hunt you down. 
The decayed form feels no pain, so they must be smashed until they stop moving. It's actually Pikachu. A small animal with red jewel planted in his forehead. By focusing energy into the jewel, they can form a ball of light that propels towards their enemies. Some say the jewel holds the even greater powers, which only some of the carbuncle are able to wield. Oh, okay. It's gonna be a special carbuncle. Somewhere, I guess. The cool looking wall up, up above didn't burge an inch. Even with my awesome strength, I guess I'll need to use my head to get past it. Hee <laughs> hee, I should have headbutted it. Beware, fools to totally see harm the holy relics will hell within will suffer the divine wrath of the blue eye. Oh, there's actually- yeah, okay. Okay, they really are... <laughs> right. Shuriken? Yeah. Who would have guessed? The Eye of the Divine Reproduction. Discharges lightning upon any who disturbs the ruins or holy relics. Lightning will cease to discharge when the AI is closed. Alright. They're closed now, that's cool. Oh, you can't. I want to just screenshot the lore, and less typing is easier when solving puzzles. Again, the reason I don't screenshot is because if I type it down manually, I can use Control F in the OneNote document and find text. If there's one word in particular I want to research again, you know. Uh, Mr. St ML Stolen, thank you for the Prime, man. Didn't see it until now, sorry. Oh, right, what's this again? Vampire's Room. Let's write that. Right, enemy. Finally, I finally make my way into the ruins that look like they have, they have treasure, and the first thing I do is almost get killed by a trap. I don't think the medicine I have will be of any help. Damn. I really should have made a note of that trap that they've made. Okay. Maybe you should. Maybe you should. Do not approach. Do not attempt to grasp that which cannot be reached by your hands. Okay. Oh, why didn't I just read it? I... Anyways. Whatever, dude. Whatever, dude. That's funny. <laughs> Fuck off. That's funny. I like the sound, though. I get to hear it again. This game, man. I'll just read them so I can, yeah, cross it off the list, I guess. Maybe this would be a better way to do it. Okay, so you gotta hit this one first, and then you go in there. Okay. Who this? Sigin, would you not hear my final wish as I lie da on here on my deathbed? No, you're not really lying down on the deathbed, but... Please release my husband. I cursed, accused of crime. He's being subjected to punishment by countless continuous exposure to poisoned water. As I become unable to keep my the poisoned water for him, he suffers yet. The music here is nice, man. This one in particular is pretty sick. I gotta format this well, by the way.
There we go. He is trapped in the room below the stove. Mark it by blue. Marking up things with that are blue. That are blue in the text is actually really, really helpful. Vampire. Let's go get that chest, shall we? Nice molest. I don't know why I thought I thought it, it the trap stopped because the light was uh, turned off. What the fuck, dude? Wait, where am I now? Have I been here? Did I go down last time? Wait, what? The oh, 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 oh! I know, no, no! I have already been here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Bunga bunga! <laughs> Thank you for the best black voxel. I literally, I literally went for the thing twice. <laughs> Fucking retarded. <laughs> Fucking hell, dude. This thing's took out of place. Anyways. I gotta do this all over again, dude. Oh my god. Oh, I see what you're supposed to do. I really like the music in that room though, it's it's nice. It looks like you can break something in there, but I guess not. It does reset, okay. Where's this go? You can just still gate. Can you place the game in the, in the screen like it did with level 9 1? Uh, no, because it's uh, it's not the uh, same resolution. Yeah, it's it's a sixteen by. It's like yeah. It's. A, I mean, I could I could place it like if you want. I could do this. Transform. There we go. Now it keeps the thing. I could do this if you want, but that's as, that's as good as we get. Could take away the borders, I guess, but no, let's just keep it as it is. Hoof poof. I was running away from some big ass monster and ended up here. If you can't beat an opponent, you can come back after you've gotten stronger, right? I might be dust and bones, but I won't give up mom.
Powers and sealed with Yggdrasil by mantras. Yggdrasil leads they who can harness the ten mantras. Leads the holder of the Jed to the end. Alright, so we're, we're rehashing the, f the first game, I guess. The jet green. There we go. Nice. Oh, whoops. That's what I sent me far down. Holy shit. Path to Onvn. The fuck is that? Rata Tusker acquired. What in the fuck is that? Oh, that's him! Rata Tusker, a monster that resembles a huge squirrel, seems to have lived in Eglana since ancient times and is thought to have originated there. Rata Tusker will appear in various places, but its true form lies dormant in the another part of Eglana. Rata Tusker's strength is limited when it's physically further away from its true form. Oh, okay. Oh, those are the stairs you meant. I see, I see. Okay, okay. That was actually never explained. That's kind of stupid. Guild. Guild get. We got some software, boys. And the chamber. Now I've learned the meaning of this word. At last. You who will stop time. Light will be this bestowed upon you if you prove you have the powers to worthy of it. Oh, so this is like a. Candlestick of time. A candlestick aboard on with a wheel of time pattern on which the flames appear. Set the grand power to those who are worthy of stopping time. Right, so in this game they actually explain that. That's so dumb that it didn't in the first game. It's the candlestick of time. It looks different on the one in Lamalana. If you could carry its flame, you would have uh, the power to stop time. To carry it, you need the lamp of time relic. There is a candlestick of time in, Ever in Eglana. If there's a candlestick of time in Eglana, then there must be a lamp of time here too. Anyway, that doesn't matter right now. It's best to remember the things that don't matter for now or later, you know? Thanks, man. What's up, skeleton? Skeletons keep getting the drop on me, so I tried punching one to the ground to be safe. If we came a skeleton, how am I gonna get safe to punch two? I'm gonna get it. Okay. What's up with this hole here? Hmm, interesting. Curious. Past the roots of Yggdrasil lives Anvn, the kingdom of the fairies who have foreseen the future of this world. Okay, interesting. Interest this area too, I guess. So the first I've seen the future, I guess. Foreseen the future. The keys to secrets tend to be kept secret. Who would have thunk it? But don't take that 
to mean that you should go around recklessly hitting walls like me. Wouldn't you know hitting the walls within murals count as blasphemy? Take this advice from me, a man who on his way out. Bye bye. Well, yeah, the, obviously the wall on the left there is uh, a part of a puzzle, I guess, so I shouldn't hit it. There's a seal, a birth seal. Curious. You need to do. You need to do three. Th oh wait. What's this called? Path to an Okay. Oh, they drop weights. Nice. There's three slots here. I do remember a mention of three statues or something. Just, just a quick note. That's what's known as a soul gate. It's somewhat different from what was in Lamalana. The light above the gate represents the number of souls. It means that the required souls of some of the guardians possessing it is Memphis power. Oh, okay. So now you, you, yeah, you need to kill a cer certain amount of uh, guardians to pass through it, I guess. Golden rock. I missed my knife, man. Spikes on torch if you walk through them instead of falling on them. That said, this way makes too many spikes for me. Heesh. My ass is gonna be sort of. <laughs> okay! My man got pegged. Oh, you can get like double pegged. Holy shit. Super pegged. You have like no iframes for pegging. Same sound effect. This game seems to have more load times. I guess. I have no idea how I got down there. I, I, oh, I went down there, right, yeah. Roy! Dark Lo Star Lord's foot point. Okay. Thanks. What's that round sigil like thing? Wonder you need something special to work it. Yeah, probably do. Okay, you can't get up there, I guess. Not yet. No, I can't go with that. Okay. These ruins are full of mysteries. Moving forward, I'm going to leave a cryptic mumbo jumbo for later. Didn't think I'd move all the way forward like to the next life though. Wait, what? I'm going to leave the cryptic mumbo jumbo for later. Didn't think I'd move all the way forward to the next life though. Okay. Well, we got the seal of birth here and uh, some other symbols. The path protecting the beast, known as Sekhmet, is protected by five mantras. A path woven of five mantras. Alright. Sekhmet? Sounds like a... Sekhmet what? Urdsrut. Noted. What's this then? Wall went away. Nice. One of these is gonna have like a breakable one of them. I, I prom- I swear to fucking god. I don't think I will. There are words written on the mural, but they are too big to scan. So using specialized software. Okay, we need, yeah. It, it looked like it needed that, so that's fine. This is Urdrut, a path guarded by the black dragon Nidhogg. The road to the land of the dead. Okay.
Need dog. An enemy we're gonna kill. There we go. I gotta get Tyra. Looks like the roots are, are above here. There's gotta be something there. Okay. Where'd this go? Oh. Immediate peg. Nice. Okay, dude! The peg in this game is actually extreme. It's peg peggle too. I sent to peg town immediately, yeah. Oh, this is the with the three statues. Goddess seal. The goddesses look upon those wielding power and wept. They looked upon those wielding weapons too and wept. of Erd. One of the three goddesses in ancient Norse mythology, said to control fate, goddess of the past and death, nurtures Yggdrasil with the water from the spring. It's actually Norsk, that's cool. Must be fate. Cool. Verdandi, one of the three goddesses in ancient North mythology, said to control fate, goddess of the present and life, nurtures you still with the water from the spring. Skuld! One of the three goddesses in of mythology, said to control fate, the future and duty. I'll just write actually down what they represent. Skull is future and duty. Urd is past and death. Present and life is... Verdande. Cool. Goddess of Cope Harder, true. When the goddesses weep, the spring shall run dry. Marking the beginning of the end of it for Yggdrasil. Okay. That's weird. I feel like there should be a mechanism for this around here somewhere. <laughs> nice. I love this game. It's great. Evil statue. No, the game just trolled me. That's funny. I knew, I knew. That looked so sus. It looked so sus. We're on this route. Hmm, it's all connected now, I see. This is the Verdandis route, the path of to those who have dwelled in this land since ancient times.
Run this route, mark it blue. I actually place these next to the goddesses. Statue for Dandy. One of the three goddesses. Okay, there's a Dandy here again. There's puddle of waters inside the ruins are poisonous. I mean, these ruins are set on killing the hell out of any intruders. There's a treasure called the Scale Sphere that counteracts the poison. Also, you know how, how to swim? Use the jump button to swim in the water. Even without swimming, you can kind of wade through too. When you want to get out, swim while going upward. Yeah. This game is so funny! Okay. Good luck with streaming chat. Think I'm gonna go do gaming. Good luck with getting pegged. Thank you. Thanks, man. Kinda want that water though. This is based funny game. Well, putting that path that could have cleared this path, because here there's like something missing, I think. So the thing was probably blocking here and then you could probably move it. So getting trolled and pegged is probably not the underworld. That gate is the same as the one you used to enter the Glana. It can be, can't be opened without a race processing the mother's memories. And some sort of power relating to the mother. It seems it can also be opened by you unlocking some kind of mechanism, so you'll have to get, use your head. Okay, you lazy fuck. Let's loot myself then. How do you get into the room back there? I guess you just gotta grab the column and take the leap of faith. Haha, <laughs> what am I, a ninja? The path from the roots blocked the usual gate. Beyond the ancient land of origin, the ice fire treetop, the land of ongoing warfare, the immortal black battlefield, the land where the future of regular sill was set, Anfen. Okay. The land where the future of Yggdrasil was set. Anfen. Let's run market blue again. Mortal battlefield blue. Icefire tree top blue. So the Yggdrasil gate and have like blocked off all of these areas, I guess. So we gotta figure a way to. I guess I can't go in there yet. Yeah. I can't place... Anyways. I guess I'll just go down then. Goddess is seal. Goddess seal. Mega gaming? Yeah, we're mega gaming. Finally, we got a... Oh, we go... A new Lamalana game? Holy shit. Unreal. Oh my god. What a mean jump, man. Uh. Okay, now we can make a little shortcut here, I guess. Trickster sealed the goddesses. By the goddesses. That's the guy, the, 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 the husband of the, the woman. Who invites the world and shall be cursed to an eternity of poison. Oh, they did something bad. Hmm. Curious. The fuck did he do? Invites the world's end. Hmm. Right, that's where I would have been here. Right. Oh! Watch where you're whipping, it said, the achievement. Whoopsie. Whoops. 
Now we can go in here because we unlocked the thing. Urts oh, we're, already, we're still in Urts route. This is a boss fight. Fuck, I don't want to be here. I'm low. Let me um go heal. That has to be a boss fight, man. I like one HP. I, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna fucking heal up first. Anyways, Yggdrasil. I didn't mean to pick that up. Have I been up here actually? Oh, it's this area. Cool. What am I supposed to do here? I wonder. Probably get up a secret path from shit. That I find later. Whoops. That's this area. Let's go up here. There's like some red pillars. These, these things are like marked red. I wonder why. Skull's route continues towards the future. Rototstasar gnaws it on the roots before heading to the treetop. Okay. Stuff is difficult, dude. Precise clicks. Got it. Is he gonna be here? I wonder. No. Oh, three D shit. He's bigger now. You can't. Okay, I got molested. Well, I'm glad I saved. Oh, it makes sense. Uh, they weep at those who wield power and weapons. I see. So you're supposed to make them weep. It all makes sense now. Oh, okay. Intense boss fight. Oh, there's a different one there. <laughs> it fucking fell. Oh shit! Black. Oh, it's just like a. Oh my god. Scary laser. A seal locked by the four sigils. Sometimes they seal a path, sometimes power. So that's like the seals. Birth seal, probably. They're called sigils now. Maybe they were called sigils from the start and I'm just stupid. Who knows, man. I'm gonna get hit. 
boy. So now we can go and molest the other uh, goddesses of Norse mythology. Why not? What could possibly happen? What could possibly go wrong? Think about it. Before, we're gonna save. First of all... Aha! Aha! We can undo their seal by uh, whipping their statues. Interesting. <laughs> no, but... One more. Where's the last one, actually? I know I saw one more at some point. Unless it's a squirrel of his nut. Not yet. We're gonna get his nut later. Okay. We're making so much progress, dude. We're making so much progress. It's unreal. Okay. Okay! I need the... Uh, <laughs> That fucking software that abuses iframes. Where was this Where was I supposed to go again? I forgot. Completely for gore. Let's go over here. Someone goes was up there. Bit on here. Right. I just want to get that. Okay. All right. The Alfr Ciress Prophecy Part 2 Lore Probably important Goddesses live in the roots of Yggdrasil Wait, shit Spin time. The time spin called keep the roots of water red. The spring is forever. Okay. Oh. Protectors of Big Brazil Let the squirrel What? <laughs> no place it would This is it It's to be missing Water has run out. Shall reach Raeswelger in the treetops. Goddesses live in the roots of Irisil. Three goddesses who spin time. The speed time spinning goddesses keep the roots of Irisil watered. The spring is forever protected to keep Irisil alive. Odic, goddesses protector of Irisil. Don't let the squirrel goddesses get away. 
But I'm supposed to get away. No place to is it is to be missing. The full words of the black dragon Nidhogg at the water restaurant now. That the water restaurant now shall reach. Harass about to get out to the treetops. Alright. Interesting. Anyways. We see any goddesses down here? I forgot. I forgot. Her. I also don't think I went down here, did I? I did, but I did go here. Okay. This is called Golden uh, Golden Rock again. Yeah. I almost died there last time. Take notes from the branches growing from either sill. The areas branching off beyond the gate. Those who fight and those who protect alike are in sealed within. Okay. is blue. Emphasis on the areas. Interesting. What in the fuck is this? Odin? Mimir? Wait, this looks like Odin though. <laughs> a god of wisdom in ancient Norse mythology, beheaded by Vanir. His severed head lives off through Odin's magic, said to be highly wise. And that incanting in front of the bust will trigger a response. I think I made a sword too, too though. Okay. I just saw the shining eye and I was like, oh, is that Odin? But Odin has three, doesn't he? So. It doesn't Odin have, like, have an eye in his forehead or something? Either he has three or he has one. What does the same canting mean? Chant. Okay, we gotta chant something in front of him. Word of the wise, don't destroy the column. Oh, so that only... That's why a bunch of bodies are laying around here. You, may, you only live once. That's why I made the trek out here. Now I realize what it really means. Never thought that could be so ed educational. The golden rock stores the power of the stars. Okay. Thank you. Hmm. Oh, I like being able to catch the ladder like that. It's nice. V. On the branches past this land lies the for for fortress governed by the ruler Odin and his company. The fortress was built by we the Aesir tribe in order to unseal the Vanir, who sought to destroy our mother, our lands. The gates are sealed by guardians. What is this whole thing gonna be like Norse shit? That's crazy. Don't answer that. By the way.
Cool. Let's actually uh, save and heal. I gotta find a third statue. I don't. I, I thought I saw more than two, but I might have just. I might have a brain fart right now. Actually, I'm just about to get a heal. What am I doing? I heard about Lamalana EX. It's like the third in the series or some remaster of the one or two. Never heard of it. Anyways. Okay. This game is so funny. I love this game. Didn't I find? Wait, who have I sealed? I've sealed Skuld, Verdande. I'm missing Urd. Let's look at the maps. Thanks. Thanks, man. Go to seal, right. Where's this root of uh, Urd? I, I found the root of Urd really early, I remember. It was like over here, right? Or something. Don't fall through, please. Still to the left, maybe? Urd's root, yeah, Urd is here. Oh, she's like above there, right? I said it was gonna be a boss fight, I was like, oh, it's gonna be a boss fight, XD, I gotta leave. That's what happened. Yeah. Urd. Hello. This is definitely a boss fight. The fucking Moron is gonna come back. Yeah. Nidhogg! Okay. Do you need, like... Maybe his tail is the key here. No, clearly not. Right. You gotta hit his head, yeah. I'm dead. Okay. Okay. I'm glad I saved, I guess. I'm glad I saved. This is like how do you how do you melee his head? You have you have to use uh, shurikens, I guess. That's the only way. I get any healing. I gotta kill it, but this uh, scat and get healing. I'm gonna heal and save, I think. There we go. Should we get some gamba? You know, I feel nice. I feel I'm feeling nice today, so I'll, I'll do it myself. All right, I'll do it myself. Two attempts. Thirty seconds, boys. Make it count. I'll eat some of the rest of this food in the meantime, actually. I'm kind of hungry.
Oh mein Gott! Oh, Zeit. Oh my, oh, that hurts. Shit, okay, one attempt left. That really hurts. I gotta be careful of that. Check it for, okay, you know what you want? That's the back seat, time out. Any other type, anyone other wanna give hints? Any other hinters? You want the hammer? Beat the boss player, there we go, see? Too early. Oh my god, that takes half my health. OH MY GOD! Okay, it hit me twice. Alright. Let's try again. It hit me twice. You have so little iframe in this game, it's actually us unusual for me. Because like, in the first game, even without upgrades, you have more iframes than this game. You have much less in this game. You can get, like, super molested. I'm glad I didn't do hard mode, holy shit. Yeah, I don't need hard mode for this game. That shit is really dangerous. Oh my god! I tried it. I keep missing, man. That's an expensive hit. I'm out. I got hit. I got landed hit, man. Fucking hell. It's gonna be hard to land, but I think you damage. I can do it though. <laughs> like who's a dragon? Like human arms or some shit. 
Yeah, we can do this. It's just gonna take a while, but we can do it. Yeah, I kind of fucked it up there. Oops. I wonder if you're supposed to have, like, different weapons for this or something. I doubt it. It's so early in the game. Yeah, we, we, I'm pretty consistent at it. I'm pretty consistent. I just gotta land a couple of hits more. Probably. I don't know how much health he has, but... Quite a lot, actually. Like, he, he's not dying. I've hit him a bunch with... with, uh... stars. Like, a couple of times with my whip. Oh, I fucked it up. I like how we gotta wait, like, 10 seconds every time I wanna land another hit. <laughs> we got him, though. Give me that. Give me that money. Oh, mine got... Gaming. Gaming, though. What's this? Lemessa and Sean, hello. Well, where's th there's ruins, there's lava, huh? Fall into it and you're screwed, but... Uh, there's a treasure that'll make you lava bearable. It's a mystery cape called the Ice Cape. Hope you can find it. But you're still young. You can probably press through that lava pure vigor, huh? This skeleton's throw shit at me. They left, morons. Super skeleton. This path is a freezing one. The new area. Frozen tree top. Guardian mood good you must pass the frozen pillar to proceed okay okay well actually let's uh let's uh, teleport back heal and then go uh, through the to the statues of the goddesses they're probably something has probably changed there now because they're all unsealed. Pay up. Oh right, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a tough fight, actually. And I'm all out of stars too. Mine got. Look at oh the 3D graphics. This game has fucking come a long way. What the hell? Sinner's prison. What's <laughs> this guy is just like not having a good time, huh? Hello. A dirty man shackled by chains. The chain seems to be attached to the bust of a beast that is dropping poison. Oh my god. Oh, there's the ank! That there, that's an Ankh. A guardian of these ruins is sealed inside. Using an Ankh jewel in front of the Ankh will release the guardian. Make sure you're prepared for battle. Oh, mine got. Ho ho, ho ho ho. 
in the sinner's prison. Let's go talk to the woman then, see what she says. No, no funny drop, thank you. Oh, she was like over here, right? To the left? No? Yeah! Yeah! Okay. Can we get the banger of a soundtrack a bit louder? No! This is perfectly fine for my ears, so it's good for yours too. Do 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 do. <laughs> he falls over when he shoots. That's kind of cute. His soul is no longer here. Where has it gone? Okay. I did your thing. I'm not gonna get anything from you, you stupid bitch. Alright, anyways. Hmm. Surely I can make this jump. Fucker. Whatever. There's a thing instead of that thing. I know it. Okay, I need the blind thing. I'm gonna I'm gonna start timing people out for it. I'm gonna I'm gonna time people out for staying blind. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna do it because it, it, it now I know I missed something. Now I know I missed something. Like, it's, it's such a mega backset. It's like, oh, I guess I'll just go back then and see if I miss something. It's like, okay, well... Saying blind is literally just backsetting. It really is, yeah! Blind is hinting. It's like, oh, you missed something, by the way. And I mean, probably he was probably referring to the birth seal here, surely. And you can see that there's like a way for the platform. Like you see the black outline above the, above the torches here, and the wall here about to go. This wall. Ah! That wall there. Uh, when you hit the birth seal, they're gonna disappear, and you can like fly over with the, with the thing. Clearly, that's what you're supposed to do. But yeah. What's this then? There's a switch deep in the hole in the floor. Somebody bring me a stick. I tried to push it and hang my hand got stuck up and I died. High five. Yeah, I see it. The skeleton walked there. But I need a stick, actually. How's it going so far? I also changed the plan with the, with the boys. Oh yeah, uh, we were gonna play poker, but... We don't have the poker set, so we can't. Literally can't, so... I figured... Might as well just stream then. And I was looking forward to playing this game, and I'm enjoying it a lot so far, so you know what? That's fine. Nice. I I'm so good at just, like, being a magnet to enemies. Jesus Christ. Gamba Knight ruined. <laughs> yeah. We'll have Gamba Knight uh, next week, though. It's fine. I don't appreciate those black bunnies. This is gonna kill me, isn't it? Yeah, she will like push you into the lava, I guess. If you're, uh... I learned a thing or two about hitting and like... Path is the land of unruly flames. The searing street top is presided over by the giant Surtr. Those not born over here have no hope of survival. 
It's crazy. That's crazy, bro. Yeah, hitting hitting statues of women is a bad idea in this game. Well, you know what? Technically, I'm kind of born of here, so you know, I, I think I'm fine. No. No! Stop it! Cunt. There's women frogs in the roof. The color of that tree... Their sh lava sh The color of that their lava sure is nasty. It looks suspicious as hell. All of my years of experience tell me that this is impossible even with ice cape. We call that poison lava. Long sweet. Why is there a split gate in the fucking thing there? Oh my god, full heal, let's go. Fuck off! Okay. Anyways. This game is brutal. It's actually brutal. It's I think this game is actually harder than the first one. Like actually at least from a combat perspective. The second area in the game is full of lava already, like holy shit. Lava is basically instant death. It's it always has been. It's like really fucking It damages you a lot. Basically. I'm glad I didn't go hard mode because you know, this game doesn't need a fucking. Ah! Okay, fine. Kill me then. I should kill the skeleton first! Fine. Not taken. Piece of shit. I'm sure there's more I can do here, but I want to go in there first. What should I... Uh, the root. So you have three roots in this area, and they probably... Uh, anyways. No, we haven't killed the guardian. We haven't found the Ankh Ank charm yet. Or the Ankh uh, jewel. We gotta find the Ankh jewel. Oh, we haven't done this yet. Yikes, I forgot to save. Why... I'm gonna leave him red. But I'm not even gonna do that. He's just gonna be left. Not even gonna read this shit. We don't read. What do you think about LMT puzzles so far? They're good. So far good. I love this. Great. Yeah, I guess you come out of here and hit that seal. I don't think this is a way in, it's a way out. As far as I can tell. We're ghosting cell, but fuck him. Clearly he's got enough bitches. There's still this room. That which cannot be grasped by your hands. There's clearly a ladder that's gonna come down there.
Like here. I think. Well, if it can't be reached by my hands, clearly it can be reached by something else, no? Here we need a funny seal. This uh, button here might open the ladder down there, though. That's possible. What's this again? I still haven't learned the maps, man. Oh, that, that, was, that was that thing, right. I hinted. Do not hint at 3am, it will kill you. True. Honestly, I should play this in windowed. Oh, that's much better for me. Yeah, that's much better. That's so much nicer. Oh my god. It was, the screen was too big for my eyes. Now I, I can see everything more clearly. Oh, nice peg. What's this again? I have enough weights, I think. Okay. This would be a cool thing if it was like a, you were supposed to safe to hit him or something. That would be a nice puzzle. Or like a, a little hint. We might have to go to the next area, actually, yeah. We need to kill a guardian to go in here. And there's this thing. I mean, I guess I could try to, like, experiment and see what happens if I, um... Let's save first. I got some money. And some shurikens. I think you gotta go right and down. Or left and down, actually. Oh, that's great. Thank you. I'll probably just get sapped if I do this, but it's worth a it's it's worth a shot. Most likely, it's a sap moment. Okay, great. Yeah, I don't know what I expected. I don't know what I expected. Anyways, let's go to the ice area. Murder. Moron. Oh my god. Fuck you. you fucking dare. Thank you. Thank you. What if this is, this water probably damages you? It's cold as shit.
What's that app you just picked up? Your dad's research papers? What's it doing losing those? Originally, I contracted your dad and grandpa to investigate the ruins, and then you showed up for some reason. Are they possibly ordered in Eglana? And your dad is turning his research in papers into an app. That's pretty baller. <coughs> Alright. Lebesa Kazuga. Shora Kazugi. Kazugi. Sean. Anyways. The assumed history of Lamalana based on the description of the ruins. The Lamalana ruins which we discovered were built inside of a huge living being. It was a gigantic living being thought to have fallen to earth in prehistoric times. Its size is so great that for us, looking upon it, it's like an ant viewing a human and being able to and able to comprehend just how large the human is. According to the very few surviving legends, it is huge being desired power in order to return to space. The being then bore small living beings from its own body. These new living things were people who came to populate the earth. These beings called the, the great being mother. Uh, possessing innumerable large open spaces inside its body, this mother fostered these races inside itself. The remains of this structure are what we are now known as the Lamalana ruins. We've now received a request from Elder Selput to re inspect the Lamalana ruins. However, through the past several years of research, my daughter and I have already become aware of the mysteries remaining at, at, in, at the ruins of Lamalana. What was that light given off when the mothers was sealed off? What is that zeroth, zeroth child? What do the murals of upside down trees seen through Lamalana mean? Uh, could there be yet another set of ruins similar to Lamalana? I need to get my research in order so I can. Certain the truth of this terrifying theory. Alright. Great. Great. Great! Fucking hell. There's a tool that allows you to latch onto walls simply by stretching out your hand and taking a grasp. With it, you can swing around a pillar, polish it. To a mirror scene. Oh my god! Mushuvu. Platforming here in DC, man. Oh my god! This is horrible. Map moment. Grapple claw. Oh shit! We got it already. God damn. Ymir. Oh shit! A stone statue told to be Ymir, the Norse mythology proto being. The myth tells you how he was defeated by his own children, how the world came to be from his dissected body parts. And how dwarves corresponding to the four cardinal points held the skull of lo aloft, creating the sky. Progress. Children, how that world came to be. Dwarves. That was a long one. I'm gonna see after getting that. I'm gonna see after getting that. Fuck, I'm not gonna die in here. That, that area is fucking brutal. And now, I don't know if you guys have put together the, the pieces here, but we can go somewhere else. Well, we can kind of. Oh, okay, we can go get pegged. That, that's what we can do.
Oh. Yeah. Yep. Black carbuncle. This carbuncle has been mutated by the dissonance pre-mating Eglana. It can unleash the true power of the jewel in its forehead. Those who stand before its gaze will surely perish. Sigyn. Tribe Lokapala. Sigyn is the wife of the trickster who was condemned to be slowly shoveled with poisonous drops of continuous drops of poison. She tried to alleviate his suffering by collecting the drops in a container, but as years went by her body began to wither and now she can no longer visit her beloved husband. V was once a member of, of Odin, the group ruling over the Aesir. Now he has lost his authority and serves as a gatekeeper for the divine fortress. Sixth child. Kurbok. Lokapala. Kurbok seems like a lively merchant built, but has the eyes of someone who wouldn't say no to murder. He claims the puppet of his table side contains a soul of his own taking. He thinks of himself as a pretty stand up gentleman. Alright. Ooh, one more enemy and I get a heal. If, hopefully I get it before I get fucking pegged, at least. It's Firestorm, thank you for the tier 1, man. For the gift. I didn't see that bat, god motherfucking damn. Don't shoot me. Heal me instead, thank you. Oh, motherfucker! I hate that traps. I hate it, I hate it. God, motherfucking damn. That's... Why is it even there, dude? Yeah, you see the, 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 the like, way the, the floor is shaped up there? Under the ladder? That's how it looks like uh, where the treasure that I can't reach is, so... So, uh, you need ladder to appear there. Alright. I think I can make it in there. This is like the only place I can think of that has like... We need a ladder here. We need a ladder here. Fucking hell. We also need uh, the life seal. Yes, I can make it here now, but it doesn't do anything until we have the correct seal and the uh, ladder down there. Cool. The music in this game is fantastic though. I like it. So far, good. What's the game about, by the way? The uh, Ruins of Eglana. That's what it's about. We're exploring them now. It's kind of a Metroidvania type game, but with riddles and puzzles instead of um, just combat scenarios. I suppose like Metroidvanias usually also have some puzzles, maybe, but not like this much. It's not like it's not usually not this, this heavily focused on puzzles. This is very heavily focused on puzzles. Like puzzles is basically everything here. Puzzles do be the entire game, basically. Another one? What does this guy want now? The pillow looks like it's been scrubbed and polished pretty well. With a surface that's smooth, you could probably grab on with the grapple claw and swing all the way around to the other side, huh? While holding onto the pillar, try pressing the direction toward the pillar and pressing the jump button. You slide down here. Oh, you can go around! Motherfucker. Cool. You can actually go around. The music here is great, I love it. It is fantastic. But the area is so fucking... It's so dangerous here though. Oh my god. Speaking... Oh, that's... Yeah, he said this is the poison lava and it like basically one-shots you. It's insta-death. That lava specifically is insta-death. It's so... It's so bad. Jesus. Because it's not regular lava. It's, it's again poison lava. Super lava. Wow. That's wild. 
What lasagna? I can't like visually tell the difference really, but I guess it's there. I wish I had a save point in here. It would save me some time. XD. Oh my god! Dude, that's insane. Oh no, octopus. Bro, these guys are not messing around. They're so tanky. Kraken! God damn. Holy fuck, they're tanky as shit. Important question about Norway. Do you have bell pepper flavored potato chips? Yes, we do. Lacey asked, Mastermind. Thank you for the bits. I never thought my grave would be here, but I'm happy that my mother and father are pleased by me and blessing. Their blessing made me see the mark maker's light. Okay. There's a button down there. Apparently. Motherfucker. Gotta wait. There's some ice mixing with that, that there water. Even with the scale sphere, the cold probably is gonna chip away at your health. There we go. Picture! My first picture! Secret hidden by the golden rock. Hidden behind the wall pinned by the golden rock. Oh, there's uh, there's two things holding it up. Okay. Let's just take a picture of that picture, you know? Don't hit me. Motherfucker! Ah! This game is mean, dude. Fucker. Okay, the, uh, that place up there is, is, uh, is awful. We have, we have bell pepper pepper chips here, but the best kind is clearly... Uh, Oh, it goes even further. Sour cream and onion, man. They're so tanky. Am I missing? So oh, I'm dead. Let's take a. Let's go save, I think. Did I walk through the wrong area? Yeah, I did. Oh, speaking of chips, I actually have some, but I'm hungry. I'm not snack hungry. I gotta get some actual food. We do gotta get some food, though. We still got the panic button, yeah. Let me actually get some chips. I need, I need a little bit of food.
We do a little hyping, TF. Today we're gonna. I fixed my. Uh, I fixed my cabling here. So we're gonna conduct our gaming a bit differently for a bit. Just for a bit. Like so. I also made some noodles because uh, I'm hungry. Birby. I got a standing sitting desk, okay? So I'm gonna stand for a moment. Birby. I decided on noodles instead of uh, chips. Anyways. <sighs> Where was I? Where did I die? The lava area, right? Alright, we're on. I ran away from the Hell Temple but finished it normally. Yeah, I finished the game but I didn't do Hell Temple, I guess. I feel like there's probably more I can do here right now, but I'm not seeing it. So I'm gonna explore this area here. We'll be checking what happens to the time counter when you get past nine and hours of playtime. No. No, I don't think I will. Leather. Waifu, hello. Inanna, my body was hung in the underworld, left to decay. This was the punishment for daring to enter the underworld living. Abuga. What's this place called again, actually? Ice tree fire. Ice tree fire? No. What's it called? It? Ice fire tree top. This is uh, in Nanna. Oh, 
Underworld. That's an area, I guess. Get out of here. Lindworm. Water flows from the Eye of Chaos. It watches the conflict between the angel and demon and weeps at the disparity in power. this then? A guild here? Why? That cannot be. Let's kill Ice Woman. Motherfucker. Mother they have no, no friends. Yep. The heated waters of Pain gush with power, the power to surpass the body's limits, the power to rinse stab in pain, the power to ease that which leaves the hand. Okay. A race. All right. Bird statue. A statue of a giant bird. Stop. Moron. Got him. Oh my god. about to die. There's nothing here, okay. Sing, bird of prey. Beauty begins at the, the foot of you. Thank you. There's a seal up there behind the thing. I can't do anything in here, I think. Beauty begins at the foot of you. It's gonna be hell, yeah. I'm a god, I'm a god, I'm a god, I'm a god. I'm a god. Don't do it!
I'm just read the thing. Nice. Mention a bit better. Copy him. And I immediately... <laughs> okay. Well, I got the tablet. I got the tablet. It's fine. It's fine. I got the tablet. I got the tablet, man. So good. Also, I think my noodles are ready. Let me have a bite. Mmm. Mmm, noodles. Delicious. I don't want to stand on it, that's terrible. I actually don't want to stand on it, that's actually awful. Where did I get my fucking actual man? Is there anything I can use my... Um my climbing clothes for here? Actually? There's nothing really I can think of, but... I think in this room I can use it for. Not here either. Which noodles are these? They're just like spicy noodles. Basic Norwegian brand. I fucked it up. God damn it. We can still do that though. <laughs> we still have the panic button. It's all good. <laughs> it's all good. No pegging. I like how the game instantly just hits you with like a instant death trap. That's just beautiful. Love it. Oh, Jesus Christ. It didn't look like you could walk on it, okay? It didn't look like it. Leave me alone. Fafnir. 
Oh, okay. Fafnir. Drops treasure chest. Legend tells of a dwarf whose duty was to guard treasure. This dwarf became the dragon Fafnir. So great is his power that he once made an enemy of his Aesir. It is said that those who taste his blood or heart will gain knowledge above all others. Huh. A guardian. Maybe it's the boss of this area. Spider again. Or crab snake. Or crab snake. Right, okay. There's this room. And everything you can think of here, I guess. There's a refill for your lamp there later, I guess, but that's about it. This is the golden rock, right? This is this area. Yep. I should probably just go to the ice area and look for a birth seal, to be fair. It's really it's really fucking dangerous in there, but I have, at this point I guess I have no choice. I have no choice. We just gotta go there. Have you ever played Rainbow? Yep. I have. Yikes. Here we go. But at least it's, the soundtrack is nice. Oh no. You're fucking kidding me, dude. You're actually fucking kidding me. Fuck off. Fucking hell. I can stand, have some noodles. Mmm. <laughs> Delicious. I just love this game. I love it. I love it. Thank you. Remember that the Lamelani gamers said that difficulty is covered straight and the starts higher? Yeah. God damn it. So it's good to have started with the first game before we go into this, I guess.
my house noodles with my wife. Mm. Mother oh, just yeeted himself. Yeah, he just died. Nice. Thank you. I hate these things. I'm about to get fucked, aren't I? We're not good. We're not good at all. I think I'm dead. Fucking hell. Yeah, okay. Okay. This place is... This, this is hard. This place is not easy. Tentacle land. Yep. True. This one's actually hard. Yeah, like the, the enemies are difficult, uh, the bosses are really difficult, like everything is really hard in this game. Which is nice, but uh, I'm kind of struggling to get through the area. In the first game, you can kind of just like walk wherever you want in the beginning, because like nothing really poses a big threat or anything, but... In this game, the second area you get to is like fucking molest hell temple moment. Mega molest. So you get the thing here and it allows to go up there on the pillars. I might as well just reset now because I'm gonna die. I've died a lot, haven't I? Goddamn landing leg. Why did I... Okay, just kill me. There we go. Why can't I just make that jump, man? Please. Just let me make the jump. I, I, I beg. I actually beg now. Just let me make the jump. Just let me get over there. And I can't kill the enemies because they're so tanky. And before I kill them, I would actually just be sent down myself. Like, by knockback. I gotta get my uh, chain whip, man. Lava, god damn. True. Fuck lava. There we go. Most of here again. Okay, nice. Okay. Why not? At least they get like hit stunned, I guess. This is new. 
the god of prosperity, Gan Ganesha. Those who possess the talisman of Ganesha's protection will be blessed with prosperity. Ganesha, blue, talisman, green, oh there's like a oh, water trail here that you can get fucked by I guess, sent to the right. This is, I hate these slippery floors, they're so annoying. More annoying in the first game, because in the first game you can kind of like circumvent it by jumping straight up. In this game though, you can't do that. Immortal Battlefield. The Infernal Fiend bites into the neck of the Colossal Dragon, thus binding the two together. Okay. Immortal Battlefield. Make headline. Poison lava here too, nice. I'm dog stuck. I actually just have to teleport out. Okay. That's funny. <sighs> Poison lava? Yeah, there's, t there's two types of lava apparently. There's regular lava and lava that like does more damage than lava for some reason. Mad. Okay. What's up? Hey there, you scored a hand scanner, huh? Without that, there isn't much you can do. You can use hand scanner for stuff like reading tablets and inspecting important looking stuff you find in the ruins. As an archaeologist, you gotta be able to read the ancient texts written on the tablets. Also, members you find with skeletons, signs, stuff like that, too. There might be other stuff you can inspect with it, too. If you find anything that catches your eye, try inspecting it. Nope. Thank you, Selpun. Can't go up here can I, quite yet, can I? Nope. The Selpun statue is bigger now. Teleport is pimping, yeah. It's got beautiful women and fast cars. Yikes. Let's try running into that stream of water then. See what happens there. Maybe something cool. Fucking mo- my god. Wanna wait for her to pass. There we go. Up here. In here. 
up some uh, soul. God gamer. Oh no. Okay, that was a trap. <coughs> Anyways, now we know. Something there either. I might be supposed to be doing more stuff here, but... Maybe I can find the ank somewhere. If I find the ank, I can fight the boss. If I fight the boss, I can get to a new area. Right. 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 The ank charm, I mean. The charm. Not the ank. I found the ank. For every other statue, the little walls next to it disappeared. Why doesn't it do that now? On this one. It's sus. Thank god. I tried to clean a curry stain off my shirt, and this was the only water around. I'm not a clever man. <laughs> okay. Nice. Hmm. I need some seals, man. X to CL. Oh, I see. It's it's formed like a tree. So like on the top right, that's one exit. Top left is one exit, and then the top is like one exit too. Makes sense. They will lead to like three different areas or something. Interesting. I still just have to double check the area. What else can I do with these grapple claws, huh? Could I possibly get that? Hmm. I can't do this thing. I can't go down here though. If I didn't lock the area with the uh, claws, but I mean, you don't need anything to unlock it, I guess, but... Should I go to the right? The right here is a little lamp room, no? Yeah. Lamp room. I haven't read that tablet, I guess. Haven't been here. I have not even been. What the fuck is wrong with me? Why didn't I check this? That's my problem, man. Any more weight? I should have bought a lot more at the above ground. Let this be a lesson to you. Better safe than sorry. True. The seeking blue fish sears flesh. Rejecting all life. Cold steel alone may pass unscathed. Okay. The seeking blue light sears flesh. What is it? Did I say fish? So it's telling me that I can sh throw shurikens through these lights.
That's the thing in the floor that I said was gonna open, didn't I? Yeah, I did say that. So smart. The, Va Va the Vanir, who sought to destroy the Great Mother's world, exiled to this land, the branches of Eglana, wherein they were sealed. The Vanir must not be awakened. They are the negative comp con counterparts we birthed. Negative counterparts, we burden. Okay. Interesting. Let's see what's down here then. Okay. Well, I can't hit the wall down there, can I? So. this actually need hog oh I kind of already killed him but anyways anyways yeah that's the thing yeah yeah, yeah. there we go because you can go in there faster now Nidog is a colossal black dragon with an oddly manufactured appearance who dwells at the roots of Yggdrasil. According to a legend, he communicates the state of the roots to Ratatusker, servant of Hrathvelger, who resides at Eglana's treetops. His massive frame and fire-based attacks boast immense power. Those who cannot match his such power shouldn't attempt to challenge him. Alright. I can do here? I feel like I've been to every room and done like pretty much everything. I feel like I have. And those were like the last two rooms to, to go through, right? I've been. I should I should note their names actually. Thanks. Oh, I already noted that. Okay. Classic Bino breaking up progression. Yeah. I guess. I should read the notes over here. Urdus route, a path guarded by the black dragon Nig Nigdhog, is the road to the land of the dead. But on this route, a path to those who have dwelled in this land since ancient times. Skull's route continues towards the future, through the Tusker Gnasana route, before heading to the treetop. The land of origin, ice fire tree trap. I think in that in that case the origin seal is probably there, no? 
I would guess so. I could explore it a bit more. It's just so fucking dangerous there. It's unreal. It's actually so fucking dangerous. <clears throat> the soundtrack slaps? Yeah, it's, it's good. It's a little bit repetitive, but it slaps. You just get like, tired of hearing it after a while. Because it's like very repetitive, like really. Nice. So this is the, the land of the undead, and also the land of origin. That's that's so smooth. So smooth, man. The momentum I get is insane, holy shit. Fuck the Kraken room. Fuck the Kraken room. Fuck the Kraken room. This is death. Yeah. Confirmed. One, f one wrong fall in that area and you're just like basically dead. Need a damage upgrade or something. But I feel like I've sure they got more shit here. I just can't figure out how to fucking do it. There's a chest. Pass the trap with the thing you're not supposed to approach, but I can't get it. There's a couple of paths out, but I don't have the seals to open the gates. There's a gate with a guarded by a boss sigil that I get to beat the boss to, to get to. There's the golden rock, but apparently the solution to that is behind it. So. With a rock behind it. But I can't break that rock yet, so anyways. I hate that fucking slide in. Jesus Christ. Horrendous. I see it. Great. Fuck this. Ah! <sighs> Hello, man, to the Kraken. No, 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 no. Over the Kraken, we're good. We're good. Oh, stop it! Motherfucker, she was so far off screen that I didn't see it coming, man. This game is brutal as shit, man. This game is fucking brutal. This fucking game, dude. <sighs> I can do it, though. I can do it. Yeah, that's fucking heal, man. All of the activated in fucking ninja mode. Platform. Yes!
We got it. XQCL. I guess killing them all did nothing. In the midst of the ominous, twisting sweater, the two words that will illuminate day and light. Day and night. Put the fucking chest. Guess there's nothing to do in this room for now. It seems like there's gonna be a boss here or something. Oh great, Kraken time. Is he gonna get lifted up by it? Okay, great, that's perfect. I'm dead. I got fucking- okay. Okay, thank you. I think I've checked at every room there now. I don't see anything to do, so... Hmm. Yeah, hentai got me. So I got that. Is there any other puzzles? There's the yellow rock is the only thing I can think of right now that I can probably maybe do, but... What does it say about the yellow rock? The secret hidden by the golden rock, hidden behind the wall, hidden by the rock. <laughs> Pegasus, thank you for the, for the sub, man. Oh, peg champ. There's uh, something hidden behind the wall here, I guess. You gotta encant in front of this guy. I don't think I can do that yet. Power of the stars. How did that guy get behind it then? To hit the to hit the thing behind the rock, I would have to need I would have to get a knife. Without a knife, I can't actually hit that. That's the problem. My ass is gonna be sore tomorrow. Yep. Origin seal. A seal inscribed with the lava land on the mural one, signifying origin. Can be destroyed with the sigil of the corresponding character. Yeah, we don't have that. I feel like I'm supposed to have the seal by now. Like, I should have done a personal trick to get the seal. Because everything that remains here now is this, uh, related to the seal. Like, if I had that thing, I could probably do a lot more. But I could do a lot more. It's just finding the fucking thing. What's up with this area? Hmm. 
What's up with this stone tablet? It just has some myth written on it. No hints, come on, give me a break here. Right. I can't believe I'm already dog, dog stuck. Holy shit, that was quick. That was first session, already dog stuck. God damn, alright. That's, that's fine, that's fine. Don't worry about it. Here I can't do anything. I mean, I have the claws, but I, I and I can get in there, but it doesn't seem to do anything. How did you get into the room back there? Guess you gotta grab onto the column and take a leap of faith. What am I, a ninja? Yeah, like I can't do it. But there ain't shit here, though. So. Those that mother's power must undo the locking mechanism to proceed. All right, okay. Hmm. Thank you. Base damage boost. up to that area. Thanks. Okay, tremendous. Need some help? No. No, I don't think I do actually. Stop oh, don't 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 come on. Come on oh my god dude. Can I just stand on the fucking thing? <laughs> Please Thank you. Hmm. Again, seal. There's this funny area again. Where's it gone? I was hoping that uh, something would happen when I when I when I fucking helped her out. Just piece of shit. And I did the fucking thing for you, you bastard. Oh my god! Oh, cooming! I, I was thinking of trying that for so long, though. God damn it! Oh my god, boss time! I was thinking of doing that for so fucking long, man. The treasure is called an ankh jewel. If you, if you can destroy the ankh where the guardians sleep, the guardians are big ass, scary ass monsters in the ruin. Eglon is a ruin, which means there's our guardians in Eglon too. These guys are hardcore, so be prepared before you go. Pick a fight. Pick in a fight. 
Yeah, because like, I, I thought that there's going to be a ladder here for sure. And then I was like, what, what, what if I shoot there? But I was like, well, I could shoot there, but there's nothing there. And then I see one of the bats going behind the texture, like behind the wall thing. I was like, wait, is that a destructible wall? And I shoot it, and it actually is. I like, fucking hell, dude. God damn it. Well, it's boss time now. If we can actually, yeah. can fight the fucker. Not even full health, by the way. Who cares, XD? Let's go. It's gonna be Fefnir or whatever. Fafnir. It's Fafnir, all right. Oh my god, speed his neck. Oh, you fucker. This. He has annoying patterns, like his movement is like super twitchy. Does he have two attacks, is that it? This guy's hardcore. Oh shit. He's faster now. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's like way more AIDS. Fuck those spikes, man. Oh my god, he actually clipped back into me. What a moron. They home in. I thought for some reason they would home in. They don't home in. I mean, oh! Okay, yikes. Ooh! Did we actually get? I had four health. I had four health. First try. First try. First try. All right. You have literally the near, but the adventure continues. Let's fucking go. Have you beat Bufadas yet? No, I haven't. But I'm about to tell me out for giving me, giving me the name of a boss. Crystal Skull? Already? Is that a Crystal Skull that you just got? I heard that the ones left in Lamolana had been stolen. This may be different from the ones in Lamolana. I'd like to look into it, so bring it to me when you have the time. Okay. Let's do that. For these nuts. Okay, you know what? Hey, that's fine. I would rather have that than uh, an actual boss spoil. So that's, you know what? Thank you. This school is said to have a unique ancient epitaph on it. You made it back. That's fine and well. But please show me the crystal skull. Come on, quickly. Hmm. It shapes slightly differently than one in Lamalana. Let me hold on to it for a while. I want to look into this. What? He stole my crystals? No. Go back to the village and keep the elder occupied or, or some such to pass the time. I'll finish up quickly. Alright. There's a thing up there. There's a fucking note. Oh.
I love the music here. It's great. Fucking castle. There's a crystal skull. Your dad found one when he, he was investigating Lombolana ruins. Just how many of these are there, anyway? Oh, really? Booba. I wonder what this is used for. But he's probably gonna tell me. Are you on ho hard mode? No, and thank god I didn't do that. Because this game is already hard as shit. This game is much harder than the first one, I can tell you that. That's just facts. <laughs> Nobody's gonna mail me when he has finished looking into it. Oh, there we go. This crystal skull you lent me is pretty interesting. It seems as though there are 12 of these in total. Among the materials I was researching was something called the 12 seal inscriptions. Apparently, the various seals can be broken in accordance with the number of skulls in your possession. Anyway, I've digitized those research materials. I don't know what's written in them though, but I mean, they were sealed, so... Skull acquired. I'll just write it down, fuck it. Apparently, the various seals can be broken in accordance with the number of skulls in your shun. Anyway, I forgot a dot. There we go. Anyway, uh, I. There we go. Let me just uh, highlight the way things in the correct order. Twelve seal inscriptions should be blue. There we go. All right. Come again. Now we should be able to go into the area Down here I think it was down here or something There you are Oh my god Divine Fortress I'm too smart. I'm too smart. I read the hint about that a while ago. That steel can pass through the light. That bluish glow is the ruin's famous barrier. It's a sizing little trap that can gills, grills up anything passing through it. Hmm? If something wasn't alive, it might be able to go through. Like steel or something. A shurik Oh, he actually just outright tells you what to do. I thought of it myself. I, I didn't need his fucking help. Okay. Shoot at it. Oh, why is he telling us that? Dude, this... <laughs> It was already a hint. It was, I, it was literally already a hint. Yikes. Divine Fortress. XQCL. 
XCCL. Anyways, new area. Dog. And a tablet that we need software for. Hello, dog. Ain Harriar. Sold to coins. Spirits of powerful warriors assembled for the coming of the end. They were originally gathered at Valhalla, but were later dispatched to the Divine Fortress to attack the Aesir. Um, or Asir. They display their power only at the command of the Valkyrie. When their bodies turn red, they become invincible. It's a boar. It looks like a dog. A b wild boar faster than any horse. Gullin... Gullinbursti is docile until he spots an enemy, upon which he bounces forward like a juggernaut. He is said to have been created by the dwarves Brokker and Eitri. Alright. Hello. Hermod. This is the Divina Fortress. This fortress was built for the purpose of sealing away the Vanir. Vanir. A race born of the us six children, and one which would see the world destroyed. The hole in which they live is sealed off by a gate. We Asir. We Asir? Oh, he's Asir? What the hell? We Asir, also of the six children, have been sealed inside Eglana for continuing battle with the Vanir. No one here wishes the end of the world. Okay. There we go. Right click photos on OneNote to enable searching in photos. Really? Is it called alternative text? No. Can't do that. No. Don't do anything stupid. Alright, Helmut. Money. Chest. Map. Odin's corridor. Noise. Tch, 
antechamber again. But we gotta be careful what I hit in here. Aim and shoot. Oh, I see. Oh, mine got. Oh shit! Bitra, the calamity of the vanished creation. Created to overturn the precious scripts of the end. Hold up, I gotta write this down. Vritra. The prescripts of the end. There's in an ank. Storing energy until that they are reverse. Alright. Thank you for the sub, uh, Shuma. One three seven. Well, I guess I'll just keep this. I guess this is the boss of this area or something. That do be the boss. We got a safe spot. This is the Divine Fortress, where the Aesir preside over the Vanir... Aesir preside over their Vanir cap captives. Nice. It's funny, in the first game I was like, clearly they have taken a lot of like uh, mythology and religions from other cultures and there was nothing for like Scandinavia or like Northern Norse stuff, so I was kind of disappointed. And then it turns out the second game is literally just that. <laughs> as far as I could tell, I was like the only one that was not in the first one. Well, not the only one, but it was clearly missing. Clearly. They were saving the good shit. True. Four fairies live on with it in Yggdrasil. Work this out. Who obtained the fairy king's grace? Oh, there's there was a fairy queen in the first game. There's a fairy king here. The light of the fairy. Summon a door. Cool. Wait, the fairies are already here? What the hell? I don't... What the hell? My, my lady. Look, Alfar. A fairy fallen into darkness. She is unable to use storm-based magic. Dukalfar was one of the Alf Alfr. Put under a curse by the Vander, so they might make use of their talents in battle. Damn. Fairies? Investigating these ruins will be a lot easier if they lend to their powers. They've got various powers, like health restoration. There were fairies in the ruins of Lamalana, but those were created with the Tree of Life, a machine used to create life itself. I heard from the Fairy Queen that the originals from which they were copied were trapped inside Eglana. If you spring them free, I'm sure they'll cooperate. Nice. 
Epic. Yeah, got him. Got him. Okay, nice. Thank you. How would one go about opening this chest? There's a platform there, though. That probably just opens the light thing, right? Yup. So now I can do that. Nice trap. Not today, though. Not today, though. I'm sorry, but... Let's see. Soul gate is sea led by the souls of those who keep guard. Extinguish the lights of souls at shed above the gate. Offer as many guardians as lights. Then Lo, the gate shall open. The game is really brute forcing this this one hint down your throat at this point because I've, I've I've like read this like five times already and it's still telling me that I need to like, <laughs> like I already know this like ten times, man. Like okay, how about you teach me some puzzles instead? Jesus, man. But sure, why not? <laughs> That's right. Vanir seal. Uh, bastard. Bastard. The game thinks I'm a moron, dude. Especially that one hint by the where you're supposed to throw the shuriken, that was very offensive. That was like an offensive hint. Oh, hello. Broker, get out. Damn. Atri, who are you? You have no place here, get out. <laughs> okay. Atri and Broker are here. Let me note them down. It's kind of probably important to know that they are here. In they are in fact here. This is the seal of the morons. No, maybe it's not. I can go up there, actually. What does this do? Lick oh, liquor path. Hello. All right. Why not? There's a ghost with a knife. It's kind of spooky. Oh! He shoots people at me. Okay, he does not like me being close to him. Cop. Hey, he dropped this thing, but I can't. Oh no, I gotta go get it. I gotta go get it. I gotta go get it. Valkyrie. That was it. I just needed a billion of those. Okay. Ooh, thank you. Okay. All right. In Valhalla, there's a pond of poisoned water. The Vanir sunk the treasure in its tainted depths. Hmm, inter interesting. Valhalla is blue. Vanir is teal. P 
Please, why not? Can I like get my color selection up? Why is this program retarded? Why is the program retarded? Hello? Dude, if you guys saw this, you would actually puke. You would puke if you saw this. That's a, yeah, I knew it. I fucking knew it. Well, if I climb under there, then I will get to the... Um, to the door that I can't open yet, no? That I need to uh, open a mechanism to, to unlock, no? But there is a button there. I should press the button, actually. I'm sorry, fairy. Ow. Okay, dude! My god, frogs. Sanctum path. Look at that. Valhalla, where the souls of warriors gather, where there are twelve thrones, rafters of spear shafts, roof. That shed of shields. Epic. Take a picture of that. Some guy sitting on this throne or whatever. Maybe important. Morons. Charts, Pog. Oh my god, mad money. Yikes. Okay, dogs. Dogs. Oh, it just opens. Alright, it just it straight up opens. Sure, why not? Valhalla? We're here already, I thought that was gonna be a later area. <laughs> what the fuck? That was quick. This is the Fortress of the Vanir. Fortress of the Vanir. Defeat the... Aesir, who sought to destroy Yggdrasil, the calamity Vri sealed here until the day comes for the end. All right. Calamity XD. Let's explore the other area a bit more first. Before we go in there. Seems like I can actually walk in there, hold up. Into the ceiling. It seems like I can walk into it. It was seemed like there was like a open space there. Hold up. Let me check that. Motherfucker. in there? Let's see. No, I can't. Okay. It just seemed like it for a second. You never know with this game, man. I 
I swear to God. I swear to God, dude. Okay, thank you. Is there anything else here? Hold up. Did I try going right here? No, I don't think I did. Let's try that. Okay. We of Odin see a lead it behind that gate. Do not approach as you pina for the end. Alright. Clean yourself, thank you for the tier one man. Arigato. Origin. Oh, Origin Altar. Oh, what could that mean? What could that mean? There's an item in here, I think. There's an elevator that doesn't work. The, mig the migratory ravens, Hugin and Mugen, Odin's servants, protect protectors of a sigil. The birth sigil. Okay, Hugin and Mugen, give me the fucking thing. <laughs> I remember reading about this. That's funny. Moon in, moon in. Wait, they're a boss! They're a fucking or like a mini boss or an enemy. They wash over the fucking thing and you gotta kill them. Sad. That's sad. Alright, man. Two birds and a sigil. I don't want to kill them, but... What can you do, right? What's down there, though, in the... Tyr! I've heard that the trickster of Yggdrasil has been freed. I saw a light fly toward Valhalla. I believe he came back for the purpose of reawakening Vi Vritra. Our own race created this disaster. It is the beginning of the end. Why does he have such silly music? There we go, Valhalla is blue. Vritra is red. There we go. I was listening. Good. Oh, who can the moon in? There they are. They're shitting on me.
Mord and Birdshit. You can't break them, okay. Motherfucker. That's right, that's right. That's fucking right, that's right, that's right, get fucked. More like Hugin and Moron. Give me that fucking- Oh, Origin Seal, oh, beep boop. Here comes the email from Excelpod. No, no cell phone? Okay. Oh, we can- we finally got it, we finally got the seal, boys. Origin Seal. I did the thing. Oh my god. Fairy King's boat. Oh, Fairy King, hello. I can already gray out some fucking notes now. There we go. I do not hit the boat, I guess. I cannot be reached by your feet. Turn back. It couldn't be reached by my feet. Turn back. Careful that your toes don't get pinched. You don't want to end up like me. Let's save, actually. Progress going pretty steady so far. Pretty steady so far. Until we hit a roadblock, I guess. A lot of chest. Pog. Items back to back. Pog. Oh, the actual What? That was fast. Alright. Why not? I'm gonna wake up and get instant iframes. <laughs> Any progress in less than minutes? Yeah, we killed the mini boss, got a new seal. I'm gonna go and use that in this area now. We found an angst jewel for the next area. That was very, very quick. Up here, I think. There we go. There they go. There they go. Weapon. Knife! My beloved. My beloved bottom hitbox. Oh my god. My actually beloved. Epic. It's a lot slower in this game than in the, in the first, but knife is still good. I love the NPC music in this game, it's fantastic. You can use it while moving. Oh, that's so good though. It's actually, yeah, it's, an, it's a straight up upgrade then. It's a bit slower, but you can actually use it while moving, that's insane. You don't get stuck moving still while using a knife, that's so good. And it seems to do comparable damage to the whip as well. Britain moment. You fucker. That was not it. Okay, I thought it was. That's a shock, anyways. 
Okay, so the knife is not the solution there, there's something else. Oh, it's obviously, yeah, you gotta... Mimir. You gotta do something with Mimir. You gotta chant in front of Mimir. That's the thing here. But I thought we would have to, like, stroke that rock. You know? Now, there were many more seals here, I'm pretty sure. There were more seals. Knife is a big improvement, though. So now I can hit. If there's a secret that you have to like hit the floor below you, I can do it. Great, I'm I'm, I'm good at games. This is the daughter of the dude in the first game, yeah. Yup. No seal here, but maybe I can hit the the, the thing with my knife. That would make sense, but I guess not. Uh, let's go here then. Go here then. I think I ever went up here, right? Like, oh, I went to this is the it one shot so it does more damage than the whip straight up no matter how much more damage but it does more damage that's for sure we got iframes we're good lick rest and passed down by a luka pala sage our hidden treasure that allows one to escape death but once if you seek it you must make the climb by odin's side Keep the deity's word on your lips as you make the great cup. Okay. Great cup. Alright. Liquor is apparently an item, I guess. Yeah, whatever. Oh, is this uh, this is probably a, a place where I need the, the hooks? You need the grappling clause for this. Got that. Yes, sir. You got mad money in this game. Seems like the game hands out more resources to you as well. Gundul. Maiden Custodian of the Golden Wings. Swafa, Maiden Custodian of the Globe Power. Okay, then. When are you gonna go bold? Soon. Tor! <laughs> Fucking Tor is here! Jormungan is the master of serpents. He has been sealed away in a place known as Immortal Battlefield. Revive the water surrounding the world and the, use the golden key to call upon him. I too once tempted to defeat him, but was no match for the serpent's power. You will struggle unless you borrow the power of birds, moved by a golden key. Alright, Thor.
Uh, I guess I could write all of this. Jormungand is a boss. Golden key is green. There we go. That'll do. Humph. Poppies, thank you for the tier one. I gotta stop taking damage, man. Now! The Lord sits on the true throne and encants fire rain upon the earth. That's probably gonna be very useful later. Fire is blue. Earth is blue. Thank you. Got it. Fucking maggot frog. Oh, you can't actually. You can't even begin to push them unless you have the gloves in this game. Crazy. That's wild. Go on, jump. Okay, or not. Room of Generations. And last one was called what? Same thing, okay. Stop it. Whoops. Oh, you fell all the way down here, god, the motherfucking damn. I should probably heal, though. Yeah, let's do that. So we're playing against the 3pm is now it's 11. Gamer. Real gamer. Right here. Where did my life go? <laughs> True! Nice. Nice Maggot Frog. What the hell? I find out he's streaming La Milana on a Saturday. My man's addicted. No, we, we changed the plans for today. Uh, we were gonna actually do some other stuff today, but uh, it got changed because, like, we were missing the... Nice. We're gonna play poker, but we missed. We didn't have a poker set. The poker set was like gone, so we couldn't do it. So we figured we would just do it another day instead. Wait, that was where Hooded and Moon was? Just the fairy ball. Guess I went somewhere else. Maybe through here? Yeah. Amogus, Amogus, Amogus. There we go. We'll go up this time. Yes, sir. I think I want to come from here from above. Yeah, I think I do. 
Just one, I, just, I just had to check that wall, man. I just had to. I was trying. Cup of Suma. Cope. Uh, Skogol and Regenlef, Maiden Custodians of the Rustic and... Okay. Funny. The gamble didn't work out. When you start to think about it, heaven is just a place without any actual ground. Scary. That's clearly not the solution. Frey ship. Magical ship thought to belong to the fairy king Frey, who was born a Van Vaner, created 50 trillion blacksmith. The fact that it's constructed well enough to cross the sea of chaos believes it's collapsible, portable from nature. The lies, it's okay. Yeah, I was, anyway, anyways. More on. All right. Thanks. I guess it's Valhalla time then. But first let's heal again. Actually, am I close? I'm kind of close to getting a heal anyways. Yeah, I'll get a heal away there, fuck it. Are liking this game in comparison to the first? Yeah, I, I like it. But it's a bit too early to say which one I like the most at this point. A little bit early. This knife is so good, dude. Incredible. That's some really nice quality of life changes? Yeah, I think so too. What a seal. That's probably just a map now. Yeah. Wall of Spears. There's a cat with three eyes there. That's crazy. There's a walking maze. What the fuck is this? It's actually a walking corn. Kaboon looks like an ear of corn that's sprouted legs. They aren't quick, but have, behave, have extremely tough bodies. It takes a while to bring one down. It's said their bodies are hardened to guard their gold at the center. Okay. Kinara. Kinara is a monster with the upper body of a woman and the lower body of a bird. Originally, they had a quiet temperament and an appreciation, appreciation from Ruth I talk for a living. 
quiet temperament and an appreciation of music. Tensions within the race have turned them violent, and they use sound as a weapon. There's a throne. Who in it? I felt the soul of the trickster of Yggdrasil. He is attempting to awaken the angst of the, in this land. It's not yet time to unleash the Vritra. He's hiding somewhere. Stop him. It's Loki then, right? Probably Loki. All right, dude. There's a hidden means of binding to an Ankh. The fate of those who bury their soul within an Ankh is tied to its guardian. Okay. Low on health, though, shit. Yaland Hara's room. Cast a spear that penetrates the earth through the hole that runs through it. Oh, that's the. Yeah, okay. Now I get. I know what I'm supposed to do now. The item is reused. This is the spear in the like the hole with the button in the first area, I guess. Baga. Oh, this is a long one. This is a long one. There were once three machines which came to us six children from the sky. They were named Shiva, Vi wait, what? Vishnu <laughs> and Brahma and Vi. Weapon with the power. Weapons with the power to burn. Antira. Yes. Were rendered during the war. Bra. Bra... That bra... Possesses... 
information on egg Lana. Okay. Brahma is smart. Apparently. Here's also a spot where it's supposed to be used. Yeah, the, the, the Urdan Spear is supposed to be used here, I guess. This water drains my health and I have so little of it that fuck it, I'm not gonna go into it. I gotta kill an enemy to heal. Which is bad, for example. Thrones dotted around Valhalla. It is said that the true king sits on one, but the one of the twelve thrones. Okay. Oh my god, save point. Oh. This is Valhalla, where the souls of those fallen in battle are gathered. I don't have to write that down, we, know, we all know that. That Holy Grail tablet is called differently. Since this isn't a regular Holy Grail tablet, I don't think it would be recorded with the Holy Grail. There was something similar in Lavalana. If you got some sort of game app to load it up, apparently you can tweak the frequency to record the record to the Holy Grail. I think that something made it recently would operate at the same frequency as another made centuries ago. It's pretty much a miracle. <laughs> Is the wording on that like maybe it's miracle you need the the software? Oh hello there. Okay. Vuk. Vuk. Okay, this is a weird name. Vukub Kakwik's room. How's the gaming? Good, fellas. I'm uh, sorry, I, I haven't been reading chat because I've been so, like, busy writing down shit. And keep me, keeping me up to, to, like, date with all this garbage, man. There's just so much. Also, good night, recipe. G Anna. Fuck this thing, man. The blue eye pockets. Yggdrasil. Protect. It levels divine punishment. Also, who there harm? The red I protect. Big Drasil. It levels divine reckoning. Also, pity full few who ransack. Oh, okay. There's two different dice then. Oh, thank this game is this 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 game is this is great. It's so funny when the game does that. I love it. Thank you. What's the name of this guy again? Huener. I forgot to write his name down. There we go. <sighs> oh, I hate this game, dude. I hate this game, dude. Fuck this game. Fuck this game. Fuck this game. Oh my god. Stop doing that. Please. The gold-plated giant Vukub Cakes is protected by its two sons, the brothers Sipankna and Kabrakan. He'll be awakened when their lives are spent. Oh, so I kill them and then he will appear here. Sure. Sh 
sure. Alright. Are they up here? No. Fire after. What's this? Wait. Gandhar, a warrior of the Lokapala, originally a half human, half beast monster with appreciation of an appreciation of music. Now he has been fitted with mechanical wings and a voice with the power of sound. Okay. Push on. Do you know about mantras? You have the hidden relic known as the Jed Pillar, a mantra turns words containing power into power itself. Incant the him Himin mantra representing heaven in front of the bust of Mimir. Here in this room, and a path leading up above will appear. There are a lot of similar mechanics in here in the Glana that are sealed by mantras. Nice. That's actually, I mean, you know. Push on. There we go. And maybe we get mantras really early in this game. See, it seems like we're gonna get mantras much earlier in this game. Seems like it. Have we learned a new mantra now? No, we don't. Anyways. I gotta break that, whoops. The bloody gate. Do you know what it is, Elder? That's a big old nope. You're going senile. Oh, oh. Apparently it's the corridor of blood. Try checking out it out with the scanner. There should be some kind of information on it. The corridor is said to awaken upon drinking the blood of the mighty. It's not known where the corridor leads. Oh, I can go in? <laughs> I think we'll go here later. <laughs> I mean, there might be something here, but... Shrine of the Frost Giant. Snow in ruins like these? I've never seen snow before. It's cold, right? And slippery? All of this soft snow falling makes me want to jump right into a big ass pile of it. <laughs> Based. Don't do that! Okay, I'm leaving. Norway. What? Motherfucker, I can't leave. This is actually... Okay. I got trolled. Zoria. My wife. 
An aura spirit that's resembling a human door aurora that cloaks their body, guards them against all forms of attack. They strike back by releasing their aurora. At which point they become vulnerable. Nice dude. 100 coins. God, motherfucking damn. What is this? Hufsa. Yeti. <laughs> Yeti are cloaked in shaggy coats, smooth, dense hair that could be mistaken for a single piece of fabric. They will attack you with an ice and snow. Cool. Are you a Sweden man? No, but I'm in Sweden right now. What is this area called? Shrine of the Frost Giants. Shrine of the Frost Giants. The supernatural being Balor awaits beyond eternally frozen sealed lands. Lord keeps guard over the garb on by Anun Anunnaki. Those who don't. Who done the garb must pass the pillar for then neither yet nor cold shall ail them. Pillar of a swirling light. Alright. Sure. Oh. Okay. Chill. Where do you hit him? What the hell? <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. No, I don't think I will. I think we're good. We're good. Airstrike dragon. I think I'll uh, stay clear of that. We can't teleport to Valhalla, I guess. But I want to explore more of it. It was like, yeah, it was over here, no? In we go! I love being able to drop down ladders. It's amazing. Actually, I can swim into this water now. I got health. Fuck it. That's fucking Loki. Hello. Okay, we, we hit him, I guess. Oh no, I can't go down again. Scam. Stop that. Up, you moron. Up! Up! Jesus Christ, idiot. Need a life symbol here.
Eglana. Oh, is this close to clearing yet? I'll try again later in Lex Life. The true lord of the Asura who dis the post of Vishnu from his seat in heaven. Yaland Hara, he's unsealed here so that his terrible power may not be free. Okay. By the way, Albino, did you consider playing Don't Start Together after Lava Lana? It's also a lot more fun with friends, so it might be potential for some streams with Pyro. I could... I'll think about it. I don't... You know, no promises though. This is the word in spirit, isn't it? It instantly starts. It instantly starts. Okay. Alright, dude. I, th I recognize that. I recognize the statue. I was like, wait, I'm gonna see if it starts glowing so I can like try to avoid the laser because I have a lot to go on here. And then it just instantly fucking starts. Fuck off, dude. I even knew what it was. It was a skill issue. That's what it was. It's a fucking skill issue. Actual skill issue. We're ascending. Nice! It's skeleton peg wobble combo. Jesus Christ, man. This game. Bitch. There we go. Oh, we gotta hit Loki again. He went up and right. Okay. Need a shield, man. Yolanda Hara. Oh shit. A survivor of the Asura race of the six children who were eradicated a long time ago. The Asura were a warrior tribe who used secret art to give themselves extra arms for holding more weapons. Even among these warriors, Alejandro was the most feared to the point that he, the Vanir, attempted to utilize his power were assigned to locking him away. Damn. Sounds badass. Sit to proceed. Okay. Oh, wait. That's clever! That's clever! You just dodged the fucking thing! It's Caltrops, though. <laughs> That's nice. Alright. Open the scatters behind you, and Mr. Step on the scatter spikes, take damage. Nice. More on. More on. No, you don't. Oh my god, he throws rocks. Okay! okay. The actual amount of pegging I'm receiving today is unreal. Actual mega peg. 
There are two stone tablets that respond to the holy chalice. The waves that warp the chalice power will lead you back to the stone tablet. Okay. The waves that warp the chalice's power. Hmm. <laughs> Bargain duck. Future. <laughs> Give me that. Who's <laughs> a fucking duck here? <laughs> Peace out. Nigoro's seventh flash game, a real-time simulation about space development, a movement related app. Aha! This is the one that lets you do this shit. Cool. What happens if you, like... Warring Duck is dumbfounded. What? You're not gonna buy it? Are you kind of simple? You were all of those. <laughs> he gets mauled. He didn't have like the angry face as the other woman had, but... Anyways. What's up here? Oh, well, it's here. Okay. Um, yeah, let's teleport. I can teleport here. The sprites under the text are kind of endearing. And then just H HQ portraits. That's nice. That's heal, actually. So I got caltrops now. I think, yeah, they... they, they I need the spear to do the, some of the puzzles, but caltrops are probably just like, uh, for, for killing shit, I suppose. Being able to teleport here is super nice, though. Hmm. Let's go to the right here. I keep forgetting. I'm actually retarded. I have brain damage. Every time I forget. Holy shit. Fuck this. Fuck this. Every time. Every I'm gonna walk into that so many fucking times, dude. Holy fuck. It's unreal. Okay, he went somewhere else now. Fucking hell. Fucking Oh, this game! This game! This- this- actually this game. This fucking game. It's so funny when it does that. It's so funny. It never stops being funny. Trust me. Not today. There you are, you fuck.
Brihaspati. The soul of the tricksters of Yggdrasil is headed towards Vitra's Ankh. Vitra is not yet a full power. Vitra is not yet awakened. When the pitch black flames engulf this land, the end of the world will begin. Stop Vitra and the trickster of Yggdrasil. Okay, I'm not gonna write all of this, but it's, well, it's like so much has been repeated. I'll write the important parts about this. Oh, he just opens the door. Thanks. Right. Vitra. We get to see what the boss looks. Oh, nice, nice peg. Nice peg. I love it. Oh, my god. Big black dragon. Version of giant mechanical serpent. Vitra was fed with the dark evil of the Vandit intended to bring about the world's end. This turned him into a violent life form. Virtua's power is said to increase over time and that at the end of the world's lifetime, he could return the world to chaos in an instant. But that's just a theory. It may still be possible to defeat him while his power is still limited. Nice. Mm-hmm. You get a lot of money in this game. A lot. I'm not complaining though. Shiva sits. Okay, Shiva shits. Branches, the primeval entity of many heads and watches over this world of his creation. Alright. Mm hmm. Can't get through this, I guess. Oh, that's hilarious. I could have gone up, but I... Copium. Copium. I can't go up there, I guess, so... Let's go down here. Do not approach the Corridor of Blood. Doing so will invite the end. Those who br brave the Corridor of Blood will be ex exiled to the land that is, is not. 
Okay. Sure. Did one guy about a week ago get high early yet? Uh, no. No one has. I, th I don't think anyone has it yet, but. Yeah. No. Working on it though. Not gonna do something else here? Let's just save. I gotta find a way to get to Loki, actually. Which would be by killing the sons of this moron. I have to shit. Give me a second. Give me a second. Pure B. Hello. Need some drink. I think. The liquor. Acquired. <sighs> Soy sauce. Not quite. I feel like this game is like a lot easier on the puzzle side of things and a lot harder on combat. Maybe. Something like that. But I'm very early in the game, so like I guess that's why the puzzles are a bit simple. Because we're like it literally in the beginning. Early, early game. We have like one equip item. Two main weapons. Two sub weapons. And two use items and one sigil. Like we, <laughs> this item screen is big, and we don't have. Yeah, we don't have much. I'm on vodka now. What kind of liquor is that? This is actually a pretty good, good one. I don't usually have ridiculous like this. Um, 
It is a blackberry... Let me read on it. I think it's like... Wilde Bessen Likur. Wildberry liquor. It's like uh, either German or Dutch. It's not from this country. Someone brought it in. Scuttle. Seductive Scuttle when she was here. I think she brought it from Netherlands. And it's nice. Good thing she didn't drink a drop of it, so it's all for me. Wilden Bessen, that's Dutch. Okay, yeah. There you go. Italians have good b alcohol, come here. Yeah, isn't Italia where they have Peroni? That's, my, that's like my go-to beer right now. Actually good beer. It's actually weird how few iframes you have in this game, holy shit. So we need Sigil of Life here, and uh, we are third. I don't think we can do too much. Mm. I'm gonna wait for him to turn. There we go. Thank you. This room, this room is actually a room that kind of fucks with someone who has played the first game. Because you see the, 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 like, uh, the blue laser and you're like, oh, I need the angel shield. But in reality, you're just supposed to fucking crouch under it, which you can't do in the first game. It's really clever. Well, I mean, <laughs> it's not like fucking genius or anything, but it's like, yeah, I liked it. I liked it. I really had to use my, my brain there. Oh, you can dodge projectiles too. I didn't think about that. Probably a lot of shit you can do with that. Oh my god, Peg. Kill me. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay. Oh my god! Okay. Don't throw shurikens in that room. Bad idea. Bad idea. Don't do that. I need to get healing before I do that fight though. Holy shit. But, uh... Oh! Wait, did I not just- did I just not walk into that room before? Because it didn't spawn last time, and I guess I just didn't walk in. I just didn't walk in. I- I completely forgot to just walk into the fucking room. I think I did. And then he just didn't spawn, I was like, oh, I guess there's nothing here. <laughs> nice. Why not? He's right next to the spawn, this save point here, so I'm gonna just like uh, go ahead and uh, heal first, and then we can just teleport here. Let's just heal first. There we go.
Don't do that. Moron. I hate this guys. Okay, that does not work. If you jump there, it's already too late. Got him, boys! Got him, boys! Now that's open. Very good, very good. Can I break this? Surely this is breakable. Oh my god, it has to be. Oh my god. Do -do -do -do. Can I just walk through it? Oh, you can! Great! Do not hit me here. Okay. Dissonance lingers where children of the same seed are in conflict. When the calamity that governs conflict disappears, dissonance will be released. And a stone with a face swallows it. That's very, very vague. I... <laughs> Okay. And the stone with a face swallows it. I mean, that kind of sounds like the crystal skull, but it's crystal, not stone. But crystal then is not. Uh, who knows? Noted. Give me some healing before I go in here. I should probably save, but you know what? Anyways. Do not. I need one more healing. Can I have that? Thank you. Sip. Oh, Vitra Seal. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, 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 no. This is the same guy who's been... Oh, the boss is here. So Loki is making all the axe appear. Let's teleport and save first. With full health. He was the axe? No, he summoned the axe, you moron. Why is there a bat there, dude? God damn it. The music here is fucking great, man. Every every soundtrack so far has been fucking tight. Every soundtrack has been fucking tight, man. Ding. This is probably a tough one, man. Oh, he follows me. Oh, what the hell? Oh my god!
Jesus Christ, and they destroy platforms too, holy shit. That attack is so fast, how are you supposed to react to that? No! Okay. Oh, you actually just get the save. That's cool. This game has so many quality of life things. This is great. One minute better than this. Place your bet, boys. This is the this is the Gamba soundtrack. They made the bosses brutal to compensate for that? No, I think it's fine. I mean, maybe, you know what? I've only seen this boss so far, so... And the previous one, I guess, but... Yeah. Let's see. This this animation is long as shit, though. I, I, I wish you could skip it. This animation is way too long, man. This animation is way too long. I should probably shouldn't jump into his fucking head, should I? Oh, that's bad. Jump! 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 Ah! Get out of the fucking water, you bitch! Oh my god! Yeah, don't jump into the fucker. How about that? I hate when he does that. He just bobs his head down, like, all of a sudden. Oh, I got a good fucking yeeted. Jesus Christ. Two. That's, that's one death? That's, yeah, one death. Fuck that attack, man. Come on, England. We're fast now. Oh, we got him! That was easy, dude! <laughs> easy game. Easy game, I think. Alright, should have gone hard mode. <laughs> should have gone hard mode. <laughs> Easy. Well, the believers win, I think. Scale sphere. Something happened. This is Saman Ranta. I received your contact information from the Elder. I have a message from... from Al Sedana. I have something to give you. Come back over ground, above ground. Oh, cool. We got the skate sphere though. No more water damage. 
Didn't even see the climax of the fight, lol. Wait, did I miss something or? Did I miss something or did you miss something? He missed it, okay. Oh, you're back. It seems you defeated the Guardian of Valhalla. Did anything strange happen? Do you see some sort of reddish black mist? That is the source of the conflict itself, and the physical embodiment of the entity we causing Aglana to be internally embroiled by war. It comes from dissonance, which has been building up for centuries while the various races fight among each other. The warring races must be, must be relieved of this dissonance, or Aglana cannot be sealed off. Okay. Has been building up for centuries. The various races fight among a monk themselves. Even those still remaining within Eglana no longer know why they continue to fight. The original causes were the, of these wars differ from race to race. We need to find the cause of the wars between the five remaining races or we won't be able to find the source of the negativity. differ from race to race to find the cause there we go I know you probably don't want to hear this but it's only it is only you, the eighth children, free from the memory of the mother, who can accomplish this. Take it with you, the fairy queen told me that you can use this to absorb the distance. Beherit. I've grown very from all this talk. Please excuse me, I'd like to rest. Would you like to hear it again? I'm cool. A small stone with a person's face carved onto it. Press the item button to use it. Okay, let's go there then and use it. Let's check it out. Ah, peg. All right, funny. Don't do it, man. Okay. Parrots. The eyes glow red. Press item to use. Okay. The hurt is getting mulled. Got it. Yeah, it looks like that item from Berserk. The, the red screaming face. Right? Uh, did I get anything new? No, I just got the the face, I guess, and the scale sphere though, so I can go in water now without being, you know, shat on. That's nice.
Right. Let's, um... Hmm, scale sphere... I think I, I think I explored most of the shit in here, no? I'm sure I did. Let's actually go to the to the cancer area now. Now that I think about it. Let's go to the cancer area. Yeah, let's do that. Banger. I get more health this time. I also got a scale sphere, so I might be able to do better in water. But the water is cold, though. I do have the knife, however, so I can actually defend myself a bit better. More damage. And faster damage. Ah, uh, kill me. Wait, can I even get over there? Gotta... What? No, oh, I can't get up from here, can I? Yikes. This is just a backdrop? I th I... What the hell? I thought the thing blocked my way. I didn't think it could go, pa go past it. But I almost got killed before I got there. Gaze upon that foot. Oh, okay. We're supposed to look at the foot. Next time I get there, I'll just stare at the feet. Right? Please. Fuck off. Fuck this enemy. Nice, she fucked off. Man, fuck this area! It's so cancer! What the hell? It's so cancer, dude. This area fucking sucks. Can I even go in there? I, th I don't think I can even make it there. What the fuck? There's something down in the lava there. I think I should hit it with something. No, it's just a skeleton. Oh! You can actually make it. You can actually make it. If you're a god. The fair that discovers secrets in their hand. In their hand, a small key. Okay. God, what the fucking damn. I swear, if something else insta kills me up here, I'm going to shit myself. Just so that's known. I will shit myself. Oh, it's a fire version of that moron now. Cool. Nice. Nice moron. Ah! Kiss. Don't do it. Of course I can't go back to it again. Dude. Cancer mode area. What the fuck? Where did he come from? Dude, they teleport through the gown, dude. This area is actually so AIDS, but I have to go through it.
There's stuff that I can do, so I gotta do it. But it fucking sucks balls. Actually sucks balls. Alright, let's try to make it through then. Those jumping things in the roof is like the worst possible enemy they could have added in this area. I swear to god. It doesn't get any- it doesn't get any worse. It doesn't actually get- <sighs> It doesn't get any worse. Those things are so annoying. It's actually unreal. I need a cobalt shield in this fucking game, dude. A good thing I killed the boss and my reward was a minor convenience. How do you feel about the game in comparison to one? I think it's going great. I love it. But I've only been to like four areas, so I can't really say much at this point. To be... F you know... To be fair. Okay. Great. I could go get some the foot, honestly, but... These guys suck balls. Morons. Such a good area. Such a- okay. Fuck off! The moron. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. What? Let's play Niguro game. We can play their games here. <laughs> what? That village. Okay. What software do I have? Future development. Looks kind of like this. Hmm, I have to load it, but interesting. Actual more on the level. Got him. Fuck off. You can't break the bullets either. Eat shit. How do you get in there? Whatever. Oh my god, it's the saving tablet. Don't do it! Let me get it. Die now. Kiss. Give it to me. Oh my god! 
There's the ice fire tree trap, the searing tree trap, born of the valley of chaos. Oh my god, we got it. Pug champ. Pug, 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 pug. Oh my god. Sin Mara. The power stolen from the fairy king is mine. The power to control the flames lies in Surtr's room. If you desire this power, then bring me a shining scythe. Then I shall allow you to enter Surtr's room. My wife. There's a banger tune though. What's the name of this area again? I keep forgetting it. What is it called? Ice Fire Treetop. It's such a random name. Samara sounds like a league champion. Surtr's room. Thank you, Sinmara. Anyways, can I heal from you? Almost. I still have time for this area, so. There is a talisman that can uncurse treasure. Red Jewel, the only one of its kind in this world. A red Jewel is of the other representing the modern life. I don't know, but I'm not gonna write it down even. I know it's still a long time, Mr. Talisman. I don't think, I'm not even gonna fucking write that. What's his map name? Well, I'm glad I saved! Thanks, game. Oh. Well, I'm glad I saved! <laughs> okay. This game, dude! Actual RNG dog. Ved fall near a small eagle perched on top of head of a large counterpart. Okay, dude. I swear to God. Cancer. Okay. Can't go over there, I guess. Uh Okay. Oh, I found him. I found him by accident. I found him by accident. <laughs> oh my god. Look, who, who are we gonna kill next, I wonder. Base. Base said. I need a little bit more healing. Joust a little bit. 
I guess I could go teleport for it. Wrong area. Thank you. That's all I need. I don't like how like unclear and spastic the teleport screens in this game. It's like super hard to see anything on this. Okay, this game is so funny. This game is so funny. Yeah, just get it fucking over with. Just get it over with. Stop shooting me, but I'm standing here. Fucking moron. Okay, I'll just kill myself. Now. That fucking... Maggot under the <laughs> under that platform is so annoying. Fucking hell. Fucking hell. Nice hug. Oh, he does upwards too. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Grief, 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 grief. I'll get him, I'll get him. This time for sure. <sighs> there we go, there we go. Full health. Moron. Can we stop? Oh my god! Okay. Okay. I nail it now. Fucking moron bird. I don't like how it just like comes back and starts hugging you. It's so annoying. Like what the fuck? Nice. Maybe I should kill the big one or something. I don't know. Okay. Go ahead. Go ahead. Gamba? Okay. There we go. It's over. It's over. It's actually over. Where do you go when he comes in? He just like starts hugging you. Like a fu- Like a moron. 
He would have stuck you. One out of five. It's not an attempt if I fall into lava though. It, I have to actually get to the boss. Wow, I actually dodged this. But I got hit by a little one anyways. It's so annoying, this shit. Yeah, I just get stuck with this moron. That's great. That's great, yeah. Two attempts. Nice, nice pattern. All right. Yeah, it's like impossible to hit him without getting hit yourself. Thanks. Like, if I hit him, I get hit myself. And he will just come back and hug me. No, three attempts. Nice, good, good start. This guy will just hug you in the beginning. If you get jump, you get hit by him, anyways. Yeah, you can't. His position is like perfectly in the roof, so like you can't dodge it basically. Four attempts. Right. Let's see. Uh, uh, yeah. There we go. <laughs> like, I, it, it counts as hints, so I'm going to time it out. Any, any backseating? Any backseating whatsoever is, is a timeout. Nice. Okay, this is over. I'm just gonna like, throw it. That's a Delta win. Backseat jail. Suck Peters. What a nice position. Thanks. Right. One. I'm not even gonna try. Two attempts. Yeah, for love, I just kill myself. Fuck it. Why did I have to do it there? Like, what the fuck? Nice, just hug. Nice. Alright. 
four is right. Nice, good start. I love that he just starts doing it there, that's great. And, and it, it, how do you hit him without getting hit yourself? It's impossible, almost. Alright. Is that five? Four, okay. Didn't fall in the lava though, that's fine. Wait, can this duck under him? Lol. Okay. So easy now. I fucked it up. This little brother's tanky as shit, man. Ooh, mine got. Ooh, mine got believers. What's the. 6% yes? Oh, mine got. Okay. Cop Ultra copium for the, for the doubters. Holy. Mega copium. Super copium. Super copium. Super copium. Omega copium. We have a high roller? Wait, you 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 believed? <laughs> oh my god, we have a high roller. Did you did you actually one million! Congratulations! Congratulations. That's wild. How the fuck do I get down there? Oh, hello. Money. The, the money just didn't appear last time. Scam. Ugh. Oh, I... Sure. I was hoping for something else, but you know what? XCL. We got the ank. Based. XQCL. XQCL. Can you kiss the No, I can't kiss the camera. I can't. I'm not gonna do that. Ooh, one, someone bet the 150. Imagine losing 150k when I was like, I, I just realized I could I could just crouch and I didn't take damage, and that's what 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 it took. Oh my god. Let's see. Ye who seek the uh, sec seek the icy tree top, acquire the power to surpass Nidhogg. Only those who swing around the icy pillar. Will reach the tree top the branch. Third. 
shed for emit that thing. All right. Sure. This is not a cancer at all. Jumping lava. I'm a moron. Yeah, another one. I'm done. Another one. This 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 game is fucking stupid. Sometimes this game is actually retarded. This game is actually retarded. Fuck this game. All those with mastery weapons may proceed. Fell what foul weaponry comes your way. Put my hands on a treasure map that read Proceed 50 feet ahead of the sniping spot. Then I stop and realize that I'm stuck in here, damn it. Must have been a trap. And this is probably a joke. 50 feet. Who, who knows what the fuck is 50 feet in this game? Anyways. I'm fucking done. What this? Oh, is that a map or something? Fuck that skeleton, man. Oh my god, the fucking moron from here! Okay. Okay. Let's try this again. Classic. 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 Random fireball from above. Fucking classic. This is terrible, this area. This area is actually the worst. It, I thought it couldn't get any worse. It actually does get worse. Holy shit. <coughs> Actual AIDS. There's a map here. Yeah. God gamer, God gamer. Oh my God, see ya. I'm gonna save. <laughs> Miss Pilheim.
Time to note the nervous fucking map again. Is Murdoch in this game? Yep, she is. That's probably heal. I'll heal. Epic win. Was she in the beninging? No, she uh, she hasn't appeared yet. Not yet. What was in the chest? The map. Ginunga pop. Ginnun Gopops Chasm. Okay. Sure. Nilfheim. right. That's right. Whore! Did you have a nose for this? Didn't they have a note about the fucking bird to stare at the bird or something? Didn't they have a note for that? You did, I did, yeah. Did I, did I like, oh, I know what to do now, so I must gonna write it down. I didn't write it down because I thought I, thought I know, knew what to do. It was in Valheim. Valhalla, I mean. Motherfucker, I didn't write it down. I literally didn't write it. But I, I'm pretty sure, like... Will 
there be another video on YouTube from Inscription? Seeing Bird of Prey, Beauty begins at the foot of you and gaze upon that foot. Right, right, right. I, I wrote it down here, but I thought it was something else. I'm gazing upon the foot. This could be a different bird, but like it would be weird to have a bird statue and then that reference. Saying bird of prey, beauty begins at the top of the foot of you. Write the thing down. Yeah, yeah. I, I just thought I had it. I, I knew that I had to go here and gaze at the bird, but I guess I don't have it. Oh. Oh, the literal foot of the bird. The literal foot of the bird. There we go. There we go. Any mull. Hey, you. It's not spring. This hot spring will make your skin smooth as an egg. It'll be so smooth as any previous Steven Water and Lava. How about it? Yeah, nice. I promise not to pick, so go on in. Really? Is it, is it, is it facts? Wow, it's facts. Okay. It was facts. I wonder how long it lasts, but anyways. I still have the glow from it. Fucking my god. Maggot. Actual maggot. The dog was speaking facts. It just went here! Okay. Well, if I need it later, I know where to, do, where to go. I guess. Whatever. Okay, my god. Did I write that Muspel him? Harp Corridor. Funny spike moment? Yeah. Seems like it. Brahman asked Atum, What is creation? Atum answered by assuming the form of a green snake before leaving for battle. Creation is fighting to protect. 
Damn. That's deep. Got it. Harp corridor still. Another lore tablet, I think. The Alf Seer's Prophecy Part 5. Let's put this in their own little thing down here. Sun has no idea of the power it has. The moon no idea that it has power at all. Sling stars remain and rage. The heavens for the mighty have vanished. True. Not be seen by starlight alone. Alright. Got it written down. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Got the dog. Fuck these creatures, man. BTK. Enga Musica. Oh, it's 1500. God, motherfucking damn. Welcome, I don't really have anything impressive, but still. No, don't buy this. No thanks. Oink. 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 Okay. Okay, moron. Thanks for nothing, idiot. God. <laughs> oh, I knew I could make that jump. What the fuck, man? Come here, this shit. Feel the burn, mofos. <laughs> okay. Okay, developers. Harp corridor, yeah. Okay. Boss. The hell, man? Okay, I guess nothing. All right. Immortal battlefield. Kill me. That was so much money. Kill me. I mean, I need a reset. Give me a fucking reset. I do not want I do not want to lose that money. Fuck off. Uh-uh. So I've been over over here. Is it actually easier to get, to get money in this game? Yeah, it seems like you get way more. In the previous game, you get like money very, very rarely. But in this game, you get like 
very much more often. I forgot what was in here actually. Let me go check that. It was just scams as far as I know, but yeah. Of course. 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 This game is fucking brutal. I don't know if you can tell. Thanks. Okay, yeah. R yeah. Mm-hmm. This game seems like Lombolana, but better. Yeah. And, and the, the, the puzzles are like, I think they, they get harder over time, but in the beginning they're very much feasible. Whereas in the, in the beginning of La Milana, and pretty much all over La Milana, they're like the first one. There's a lot of places where like, you can't just have to brute force some of them, because they would be like hidden behind a wall you can't see or some bullshit like that. Like there's so much dumb shit in La Milana 1 that it doesn't seem to be like super apparent here. But at, at, at least like, when there is like some random wall you're supposed to hit, at least the game will like kind of uh, let you know or whatever. Altar of Life, okay. Because there's a bunch of like dumb bullshit you gotta do in the first one. Like, uh... Was this an extreme heat meme? I swear to fucking Christ, dude. I swear to fucking Christ. I need more health. What was I saying? I'm a woman? That was also, that's also one thing about this game? You're a woman instead of a man? Um... I forgot what I was saying. Anyways. The game is good. It's less, it, it's less obnoxious with some of its uh, solutions to like getting from A to B in this game. Because law in the first game was actually just AIDS. Like there's things there was there would be like no fucking idea of how you're supposed to get to. And essentially you would just be forced to yeah, okay. I'll go somewhere else. Fuck it. I'd, hint taken, fuck off. Hint taken. I think the the life rune down there unlocks the um, the thing, no? But Altar of Life... I want to check, because we got the, um... Didn't we get the life uh, one here? Was that in the... No, we got Origin in the other area. It was called, uh... Divine Fortress. We got it here. There's more Willbrook, therefore the game is superior. True. God bless Willbrook. Best girl. Truly. There's an area here called Altar of Origin, no? And that means we got the Origin thing there. So it, wherever the Altar of Life here, life is, might be where we get the Altar or Seal of Life. And we need the Life Seal. Not gonna lie, we do kinda need that. Origin Altar, okay, yeah, so? Well, Origin Altar and Altar of Life... Uh, it would probably be it would probably be called Life Altar if that was the case. But... No, uh, man. If that were the case. I don't know, Chief. I'm gonna check it out, though. Yeah, Life Altar, not Altar of Life. I th that's, that's what I'm thinking. Would most likely be the case. But yeah, so far the game is great. 
the movement and, and like the movement is takes a bit to get used to but the bosses and the way you progress is pretty nice so far it's pretty neat I don't think I've ever taken this route oh dark star lord's footprints it's the same Oh, this is a... Okay, okay, I see. Yeah. Same symbols in different areas. So this is like a puzzle for later. You should pick the right equipment for the job. Always prepare for the worst. Like me, I never caught wearing anything but my trusty old banana ham hammock. I made this far in life with the philo this philosophy. So trust me on this one. Yeah, okay, I got it. That's a puzzle you're supposed to like combine some of them. That's neat. That is a breakable wall, is it not? This wall looks sus. It looks completely breakable, if you ask me. There we go. That's the one I wanted to watch. I didn't take a picture of this one. Probably not important, but anyways. <laughs> she said. There's red eye up here. What do you think I can do here? Motherfucker. Okay, nice hitbox, fucker. Last. We're in a boat. Okay, well, not here then. What have I gotten lately? Not much. I got some sacred orbs. I got this. I got this thing to avoid water damage, but. And I guess we could check out the ice area more. I suppose. Three top, I've been to the top right. I haven't been to the top left. Let's go heal. Just join. How is the Lamanon 2 going so far? Is it better or worse than 1? Definitely better. So far better. Because the game does a better job in the beginning to like explain core mechanics. Whereas the first game did not do anything. It just trolls you in and you're like... Oh yeah, maybe you should buy a scanner to actually read the glyphs and shit, or like maybe blah blah blah. There's just like no, there's like no way to... There's a lot of dumb shit you, have, you just have to brute force in that game, or lookup guides. But in this game you don't, you, you can play this game probably by, by like start to finish without a guide and have no problems. I think. I don't think you need guides for this game. This game seems completely feasible, and from what I've heard it's like it rectifies some of the errors of the first one in that regard, so it should be fine. You're not supposed to be there yet. As you can tell, for that area you need to kiss the camera. Okay. 
All right, dude. Let's go to the right then. Moron. Moron. Holy shit. I don't think there was anything here, right? There's a tablet I can read, I guess, but that's about it. Inferno Shrine, I can note that though. Nice. Nothing I can do here. Oh, that's what- yeah, I got that a long time ago. Okay, nice! Fucking Wombo Combo dude! Fucking Maggot. What? My god. Oh, I can't walk faster? God damn. This is what? Great bird nest. Can you steal iframe cheese with Caltrops in this game? Uh, you have way less iframes in general, so I don't think so. I doubt it. I need this guy to fuck off, honestly. Or I can just jump into it and die, I guess. I can jump to that tablet and read it. I'm gonna try to do that. This game seems really good, but like, the difficulty curve is so high that if you haven't played the first one, I gotten used to like the controls in that game. Playing this, going straight to this would be really hard. I gotta start over there, right? Oh, is it too late for that now? Yeah, guess so. That's, that's actually, that's actually so mean. That is actually so mean, dude. That is so mean. Are we, having, are we having a lot of fun in this game? Yes. I, lo I love it. I love it so far. It's great. That is so fun to do. I hope you get to do it more. Like in a boss fight or some shit. Even though that's gonna be terrible to try to execute. But anyways. I missed it. Whoops.
That is so weird in this game. You will suddenly just get like a million momentum. Like, oh my, look at that! Now the dogs respawn and I get fucked. I'm supposed to go in here though. What the fuck am I doing? Thanks. Got him. Ratatoskar slumbers, trace the illusion's path and seal it. Then the true body will awaken. Okay. We can't already do that, but and it doesn't knowing it this helps us teleport us at all, but whatever. I'm gonna wait though. Here you need a uh, seal that I can't tell what this. But I wanna give that other seal another try. In the room here. Who knows what will happen if I make it to the chest? Although it looks like you need the life seal for it, but you might just you know. I love this game so much. I love this game so much. A black ball on a black background. Right, okay. Thank you. Please don't- oh, okay. There we go. Stand right there, yeah, thank you. Yeah. But this is not where I was supposed to go, was it? Great game. Okay. You can't win with this game. You cannot win with this game. This game, you cannot win it. You can't win this game. This game, you can't win with it. <laughs> Actually can't. Reaction. I feel like platforming in this game is much harsher than in the first one. The, the levels are, but the movement is not. That's for sure. Mm, is there anything here I can do? I want to go to Valhalla. I want to check it out. Let's go to the ice area and kill that bird, shall we? Yeah. That was up there, though. Maybe it became something cool. Who knows? Stop it. I hate this game. Oh, every time I get here, every time I'm here, every time I'm here, it happens. Every time I get here, it happens. Every fucking time, dude. I swear to fucking God. Every time I go to this area, I get pegged. It's like... Like ten times today this has happened. I swear to fucking Christ. Jesus Christ. It's covered with blood now. What the hell? I've seen this. This is the first area. A guy with dripping stuff over him and the woman with the chalice. I've seen that. There's definitely a significance to all this shit. Hmm. 
Nice, full heal. There we go. How do I even hit that, actually? Doesn't seem like it can. I can't do damage to him. What the hell? Is this a pixel moment? Because it doesn't seem like I can do anything to him. No pixel moment? Okay, okay. Yeah. I guess I won't do him then. Oh, this is just this guy. Shit. I might have some seals to use here. No? Wait, this is the wrong Gotham area. There we go. Actually, it's 1 a.m. I think you should call it a day. I'll, I'll stream more of this uh, tomorrow on Sunday. Or actually, I think tomorrow we'll finish Calamity. We'll do Calamity on on, uh, on uh, tomorrow. And then uh, if if I get done with it f too fast, then I'll stream this. But uh, yeah, tomorrow. I'm gonna call it a day for now though. Thank you for watching. This game is fantastic. I, I, lo I like it a lot. Good, good times. Um, yeah. Thank you for the subs, thank you for the bits, thank you for uh, sticking, uh, sticking around. See you in um, less than 24 hours. <laughs> Hope you have a good weekend, alright? Take care, love you all, wake up, good night. Bye-bye.